two weeks ago, I couldn't do my fucking stream because I was watching B. Dolan. One week ago, I couldn't do my Monday night stream because I was watching fucking B. Dolan talking about being B. Dolan and other people watching B. Dolan all over the country. Tonight, no B. Dolan. No B. Dolan at all. Unless B. Dolan arrives in chat or ends up playing Minecraft with us, that's fine. Whatever. Whatever. But nothing's st stopping my stream tonight. No stardust. Nothing is stopping me from doing my Monday night stream. It's the return. Get ready. It's Ad Ad Ad. Hello, everybody. Welcome in. Holiday horn. Um, it's me. Hopefully no B. Dolan going live. Hopefully that's a joke. Hello. I felt nervous. I just can't recommend Adam enough. I felt nervous before I did that. I haven't done something at the start of my stream for so long. And I really quickly rushed that uh, to get those images ready. And then, uh, anyway, I thought I was going to fuck up. Anyway, I didn't. And now I'm explaining it. Shouldn't have. Just carry on. Just carry on with the bit. Uh, it's not a bit. The bit's over. Hello, welcome along to the stream. Uh, it's Monday night. I'm very excited to be here. We're going to be doing Minecraft tonight. Hope everybody's well. Welcome in, welcome in, welcome in. Um, I can see Cutter in the chat. Going to be doing four in a bed stuff. Might do some stuff that's not really to do with the hotel. Well, the B&B, &B, sorry. Anyway, we'll chat all about that stuff in a bit. How's everyone doing? Um, Fluffy, thank you for being in the chat so early with the Mary Biscuits, just vibing with Blake Town as well before I even went live. Uh, Super D, hello, how are you? Hello, Herford, hello, M, hello, Mids, hello, Stardust, hello, Josh, hello, Sick of It, hello, OBX, hello, Tilda again. Hello, Tilda again, again. Um, hello, Scroobius Pipio. Two weeks since you jumped on stage and then quickly jumped off it. Hello, Powerful Khan. Can we get a bet going for the for time until the first blowjobs joke? Why? Am I missing something? Hello, horrible David. Hello, precious rogue, aka Beth, uh, or Beth, aka precious road. Hello, SCF. Watson, that's your that's your new that's your new thing, SCF. Is it? I, I like your new greeting. Um, I hope you're all good. I did enjoy a B stream yesterday. I watched a big chunk of it before a bit of Cudder and a bit of Sunday Night Shite Fights. I feel a bit out of practice. I haven't streamed in the evening for such a long time. And since then, I've had COVID and the brain fog is real, guys. It's still going on a bit. It's still going on. I'm feeling a lot better. Uh, but the brain, brain fog is there. And I opened fucking Instagram today. No joke. Oh, my gilly goodness. Thank you. Sorry, there may have been other subs and stuff that I haven't looked at. I need to have a look at them. Um, thank you very much, Addy. I'll, I'll reference that properly in a second. I opened up Instagram uh, today. And you know, if anyone's got Instagram, it does that annoying thing now where you open up Instagram and you see the image and then it updates and it refreshes. Like, so you've got a post there and then it refreshes and that post goes. Well, this is what I saw for a split second. I was like, what? Did that just say brain frog? And I scrolled down past all the new stuff. Just checking I'm not doxinging myself or anything. It did. An illustrator that I follow has done a logo for brain frog records. How good is that? So I reckon this person's had COVID or has had brain fog and has mispronounced it as brain frog and has decided to make a record label. What a world, what a world. Um, right, let me actually say thank you. Addy Philly, thank you so much for the resub for 10 months. Holy shit, thank you so much. Fluffy Pink Blonde, 14 months. That's two times seven, it is. Uh, thank you very much for the resubs, everybody. Uh, you need to ask, I should ask. Hello, Lucy, nice to see you. Uh, hello, everybody. 
Um, what's been going on since we last spoke? I had the weekend. I was feeling a lot better. I got to see my parents. Uh, I got to see them for lunch on Saturday. The other problem with the brain fog is I keep fucking forgetting what I've even been doing. Keep going into the house and be like, what am I doing again? Um, yesterday I took Alex to the park with her new football boots and new shin pads and football socks because she was desperate to wear them and we did a bit of football training. Uh, so she's uh, she's got that coming up, which is exciting. And then today I've just been doing work and thinking about Minecraft. That's basically what I do now. I was glowing with pride. Um, I just work and think about Minecraft. Hello, Lou. How are you? I also set this up. So here's here's a little behind the scenes. You might not even want to see this. Do you think I uh, I'm not wearing any trousers? I fucking am. My stream deck has moved the buttons around when I've set something up. Fucking, I'm wearing trousers. <gasps> I don't know what I'm going to use this for yet. Look at this. Is this exciting or not? Is it blurry? I feel like it's blurry. <laughs> Why is it blurry? It's, it's not as exciting when you see the... Uh... <gasps> is it a bit blurry? It is, isn't it? Is it fucking blurry? Oh. Not pre-recorded. It, it, why is it blurry? And look at the fuzziness over there. You got the same desk drawers from IKEA. PC, IKEA tabletop, cable tidy, which isn't really working. Printer, speakers. I don't think there's anything. There's sort of there's a picture of my niece and nephew over there when they were tiny. So we maybe I'll crop that out. There's a tiny picture there which you can't make out. There's some. Pictures here, which you can't make out. Here's my new third monitor, which I barely use. You look quite fit there. Thank you. What do you mean? Physically fit? Don't, don't worry about it, actually. Don't worry. Um, yeah, the cheap IKEA desk. What's on the portrait monitor? At the moment, it's... Uh, is I've got Discord, I've got my audio mixer for o OCB. They're a type of Rizzler. OBS and um, other stream information stuff. But I'm not, I should be using it more. I, I, I sometimes have other stuff. Then I've got my laptop. Is this interesting? I've got my laptop. This is what I used to stream from, which is on a stand on a, on a yoga block. I've got my mobile ready to go. Uh, I'm wearing tracky bottoms. Got my key lights. These are new lights, by the way. Uh, as in, I got them a few months ago. They're fucking great. Uh, I got them in the in the uh, in the sale. Now, what I'm always quite surprised about when I see the other side of streamers' rooms is that most people do have their desk set up against a wall, and that makes total sense because that's the best way to use space. But it always looks a bit strange. For some reason, I'm expecting them to be in an expansive room. Um, I'd love to see what the deal is in like Cudder's room. I, uh, I saw Cade. Cade has a new desk. And Cade sent me a picture of their new desk the other week. And I was like, holy shit, that's what Cade looks at all day. And uh, now you can see I've got this sound foam up here as well as behind me. So the sound's nice and good. Nice and good. Anyway, cool. I don't know what I'll use that for. Maybe when I do something cool, I'll be doing celebratory dances. We'll try and get the quality a bit better because it looks a bit shit. Um, I always thought there was a big space in front of your desk. That's what I mean, Addy. That's what I always think as well. It's weird, isn't it? And it is a wide desk. A good space. I can do other stuff over there. I, I never do. I could. I could. If I wanted to, I could do some other stuff over there. Over there. I've got my new chair, got my cam. This is so much better. You always want the sound nice and good for your excellent wording. Thank you. Nice and good. Did I say nice and good? God, 
Um, so anyway, that's quite exciting to have got a new camera. Uh, I just want it to be cr like super crisp, but I think maybe it's because there's not enough light coming at me from that angle. Uh, I don't know. We'll have a look. I, I, I saw around B doing some uh, camera camera adjustments yesterday on stream. His started off looking a bit shitty and now looks great. Another cam in the freezer for instant what's in the freezer. Do you reckon there's cams that can uh, survive at zero degrees? That camera, by the way, is resting on top of a picture um, that is framed and on the wall. And the other day it fell right off and smashed against a piece of metal before I'd even set it up. And I was quite worried that, um, that maybe that camera was broken, but it seems like it's okay. It's all just so I can see my own back, yeah. Anyway, um, thank you everybody for being here. Monday night stream, it's the first in a little while, like I said. I could have done a, other evening streams, but I kind of am saving myself because A, we have got Minecraft 4 in a bed coming up. And so at some point, I'm going to need to appear on like five evening streams within the space of a week because we're going to have all four B&Bs and then the, the scoring and paying section. So that's going to happen at some point. Um, then Rust. Page has a Rust server. The first wipe looks like it's going to be Thursday, October the 5th, which is a, two weeks on Thursday. And I imagine I'll play a lot of Rust and I'll probably do some extra evening streams and stuff for that. So um, I've been saving myself, saving my energy. I did four daytime streams last week, though. So what the hell am I talking about? Um, and just while we're doing the admin, I won't be streaming tomorrow because I'm going to be in London having meetings, big boy, big business boy meetings. Um, so I'll be streaming Wednesday afternoon and then maybe Friday. And then because of all the differences in Alex moving up a year at school and having different classes and the fact that her gymnastics class has now moved from a Thursday to a Tuesday, basically I might really look at when I stream and I might be in a position where I could stream like Monday, Wednesday, Friday, which I'd be quite happy about. But I'll let you all know. I'll put it on social media. I'm not on Twitter anymore because I've deleted my Twitter. I'm on B Sky Social or whatever it is. Uh, but mostly it will just be in Discord, in Pip's Discord. I still don't think it's quite necessary to get my own Discord. Uh, even though I had a nice chat with Carla the other day and... Uh, we were talking about a few different things and then Carla was just like, community, it's all about building a community. And I was like, oh yeah, no, cool, I know. I feel like I'm in a part of a community. Um, but then, anyway, I don't need a Discord. Pip's Discord is where it's at. How are you all doing? Antarctica has CCTV cameras that can stand the cold. They're probably really expensive though. Do you think Stardust? Remember Among Us Mondays, I do. I think Gusbo nearly did another Among Us last week, but we do definitely need to uh, to do that again. I thought about doing it tonight, and I partly didn't because I know that Gusbo was planning on doing it at some point. And also, there's so much to do in Minecraft. I've got so m I've got a to do list, and I'm really trying not to be tempted into playing during the day. I did go and go on for an hour this afternoon, um, just to do some admin. And I was playing a bit last night, but I'm, I basically, I've got to use stream time to get my jobs done, to get my job. That's why this stream is called jobs, 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 jobs. Now, it's basically my weekends now is what uh, Hannah and I say to each other. We get up on a Saturday and we just say to each other, jobs, 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 jobs. And then we just do jobs. There's always so many jobs, but we're all hanging out. We're so fun. Jobs, 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 jobs. D and D on Friday, yes. So when I said f streaming on Friday, I mean in the afternoon, Super D. I mean in the afternoon because now that Alex has different clubs at school, I can pick her up later, which is pretty cool. Um, so I might move, but I might move my stream. I, I said before I don't really like streaming. Oh, I don't like the fact that I've got into a position where I stream Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and then have four days off. I'd rather spread it out. So that's what I'm going to try and do. Um. Anyway, so yeah, Minecraft tonight. I've got a variety of different things we could do on there. I'm kind of 
planning on trying to hide some of it from you, not just because I think Funkle or Llama or um, Cudder might be watching, but because I want to keep some stuff as a little surprise for the night. Uh, I was saying to Cudder, I've added, there's so much I want to do and I keep having to scale back and I keep being like, oh, I'm going to do this, but I could do this. And then, and then saying to myself, no, no, do the first thing. There's literally not enough time. Uh, so yeah. So some things I'm gonna I'm gonna need to do. Maybe finding an area for where my activity is. Maybe doing a little rail line to the activity. There's loads of cool stuff to to get on with tonight. But before we do that, inspired by Cudder and many other people who do lots of great interactive things on stream at the start. Um, I know I do crossword and uh, property guesser and stuff like that. Has anyone ever done? Because I think this used to be a big deal. I don't know if it's good. This is where somebody's probably going to tell me it's shit or it's broken. Has anyone done the stream charades, charades game? This. I thought we could give it a quick go. Um, at some point, what do you say, by the way? Charades, charades. I think I say charades. Does that mean I'm... Are you going to say that I'm a Tory? Charades. Sounds a bit like a north-south divide type thing. Charades sounds a bit posh. And that's what I say. Charades. Yes. Is that what you say, Super D? Would I describe Super D as posh? I don't know. Matt, okay. Hello, Frolicles, by the way. Charades is American. Okay, good. Good. Charades sounds posh though, doesn't it? Charades. Do you call them charades, Cudder? Did you see this? You were playing another one the other night and I didn't see it. I was kind of, I didn't, I didn't, but anyway. Um, at some point you can get chat to add words or you can do custom words. Uh, I don't really know what this is. Is this like, if I want these things in there? Let's have, let's have Minecraft in there. We'll have some video games. I don't really know anything about any of these other ones. We'll have movies. We'll have TV shows and Disney movies. And we're not having anime at all. Actors and singers, not YouTubers. Animals, emojis, easy. No, objects, jobs, companies, not dance moves, not old memes. So, well, some of them I won't know. Superheroes, live streamers. Imagine, I'm not having anime, Mary. I don't know any, I don't know any anime. Imagine if we, if I had to do an impression of Limmy. Oh, it'd be good if it, imagine if I had to do impressions of our people in our, in our gang. Hello, Funko, this is going to be charades. Hello, Chris. Hello, Sir Bruceable, by the way. Uh, charades. Charades. Verbs and actions. Okay. Scoreboard. Oh. <gasps> Fuck. Okay. So I'm going to press begin, but I haven't put my camera anywhere yet. Should we just put my camera where it usually goes on these kind of things? Which is like over here. Uh, let's put my camera over here. Sharadi Raddy, Sharadad ads. <laughs> okay. Begin. Oh! My word has got. It's open in another window. Don't show this window on stream. Oh, shit. Am I supposed to be doing it? Okay. Um, I'm a bit small, aren't I? <laughs> this is stupid. I'm I'm too small, aren't I? I'm gonna need to get in it. Okay, I'm doing charades. <gasps> uh, why is my camera okay? Don't worry about this one. I'm gonna go bigger. Yes, VT wig. Okay, I'll go here. Okay, all right, guys, don't worry about it. Shall I go full screen? Why is it being weird like this? <gasps> uh, 
There we go. Don't ever try and drag something from the top, uh, top left in OBS. Little tip there. Little tip. If only you had a bigger, wider camera setup. Oh, I could do it over there. That's what you meant. Okay, if I do this again, we'll set up another scene, okay? We'll set up a proper scene. Uh, now I know what it is. I, I literally opened this two minutes before stream and I thought I've set up the B. Dolan stuff at the start. I've set up that other camera. Next time I'll do charades into that camera and I'll wear short shorts. I'm gonna get myself on Etsy. Uh, okay, next, round starting of four. Oh God. Um, uh, is this what you do? Um, <laughs> Fuck. Can I even tell you what the category is? I'll tell you the category. Job. It's a job. Ding, ding. Oh. Right, I also need to arrange my window so I can actually see all these things because I can't see OBS and the main window and the extra little mini window that it gives me. Uh, bear with me, sorry, sorry, sorry. If I had loads of time, I would have prepared this earlier, but um, I had to play Minecraft for an hour earlier. Okay, next. Oh, uh, okay, I won't give category just yet. Um, fuck. No. Oh, the first and second word. Um, that's my headphones. Uh, I don't fucking know how to do Mary Poppins. She's got a fucking, this isn't enough time. I'm so hot. Or should I take my jumper off? Where are my headphones? Honestly, my headphones are so tangy. Wow. Oh God, again, I think it's over for me. Guys, this is gonna be so good when, it, when we get it all working, right? My headphones have rubbed against all the grease that you get on the little piston bit on the chair. And now they're all covered in black grease. <clears throat> My headphone cable is covered in black grease from the piston of the fucking chair. <sighs> hey everyone. I'm never doing this again. This is fucking shit. I should have got the new camera. Should I just do it in the new camera? But how will you know if you've written it? Okay, let's, ha let's add a new scene. Right, right. Side cam. Uh, and we'll add... Uh, actually, go back here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Browser. Web browser. Okay. Uh, let's go to the side cam. Let's add window capture. Existing web browser. Okay. I sent wave after wave of my own men at them. Del. Oh shit, Del. Were you straight? Were you doing your drawing stream? How you doing? Welcome in. Hello, Rundle. Nice to see you. How did it go, Del? Fucking shout out for Del. Excuse me. Shout out. Uh, let me do you a fancy one. Right, everybody. If you were at the London gig, you will have met Delta Me probably. If not, you'll be aware of Delta Me from so many of um, Pip's streams and many other people's streams. Delta Me's a legend. Delta Me is a very talented uh, artist and drawer and uh, illustrator and all the things that you do with pens and pencils. Definitely drop Dell a follow. I know Dell did a test stream months ago, but anyway, back now. 
Um, yes, yes, Pip, you are. Hello, welcome in. Hello, Zebiz. Um, Zebiz, Loom is online. Rundle, if you're pals of Dell to me, then you're pals of me, aka please drop me a follow immediately. Oh, sorry, it's me talking. Sorry, it's me talking. I forgot I was on that other scene. Oh, friends. Um, That's friends. But yeah, feel free to drop me a follow. Thank you very much, Rundle67. Anyway, I'm just setting up this so that we can do... Um, Our friends. So Best we can friends. do stuff. Is that good? But then I'll have to make sure I'm on this side. Okay, here we go. We're playing charades, okay? Loomis Online, thank you very much for the follow. You're a legend. Thank you very much, Dell. I've, I've got a new camera. It's not very good quality. But we're doing... Um, I wish I hadn't. I mean, Mary Poppins returns. How long do I get? 40 seconds. Anyway, join in. Here we go. It's an absolute shambles in here. Welcome. I don't know what this is. Okay. Video games. I'm just going to tell you the category. Video games. Fuck, am I looking over here? Uh, oh, shit. Yes! That's good, because I was just about to uh, do childbirth. I was just about to do childbirth. Also, I don't know how much you can see on me. I, just can't, I don't know if I'm... Was, was my head out of shot then? Hold on, let me test. Yeah, I have to be down here. Okay. Okay, well done, Bloodborne. I was literally just about to do birth. Uh, next. Okay, the category is Minecraft. Yes, like fuck. I, d I didn't know how to do end. I didn't know how to do end. I was gonna, sh I was gonna like turn around and show my ass or something. Okay, next. You can't read it on the screen, can you, by the way? Uh, no, you can't, can you? Um, okay, category is company or brand. Uh, Yes. The stance is, I can't, I'm fucking having to, I don't like, I wish I'd done more setup. I wish I'd set this up better. Next, TV show. Um, Can you even see what I'm doing with the syllables and stuff? <laughs> Fucking hell. Uh... Thank fuck for this. Thank fuck for you, Super D, even. Hold on a sec, I need to take my jumper off. I'm not doing that on full cam. I'm actually quite regretful. Where's my glasses? I'm actually quite regretful here. Uh, the arm taps are syllables. Yeah. That's what they used to do, right? Okay, next. Can I skip some? Okay, this is also from Minecraft. I'm going to do it here. I'm going to do it here. Minecraft. I feel like I'm playing like American football or baseball or something. I'm giving out signals. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry. I don't know what this is. I don't know how to do the word. Uh, oh. Ra 
Ravager? Where's the Ravager? Hello, Llama. Hello, Steph. Jesus, this is a, this is a, I've, I really wish I hadn't done this, basically, as it stands. I could have done drawing. I could have done like calm sitting at my desk. Uh, I don't even know how many rounds there are. Okay, uh, it's another game, video game. Uh, um, so uh, second word leg prick in the sky yes prick in the sky i had to point at myself for legend sorry let's just move on oh okay okay guys it's a film um <laughs> that's all i mean you, you, you're gonna get it you're gonna get it you're gonna get it you're close you've got close yes one word though super d one word one word uh, how many are there of these i, I want to stop oh yeah the film sorry you're right okay I will stop in a second. Uh, time out. What? Um, uh, uh, um, Oh, fuck it. Frolly. I just realized we should have been here. Frolly 120, Super D 120, VT 60. We've got to find a winner. It was the Godfather. I just realized you can't see the screen, can you? I really have set this up terribly, guys. I apologize. Okay, one more. This is a verbal reaction. Fucking hell. We'll remember this. Do you remember when you did fucking charades at the start of the stream? What a nightmare. Um, in fact, you know what? I don't want to do this one. It was Will Smith. I'm just going to stop. How do we stop? How many rounds are there? I just want to stop. <laughs> How do we just stop? Next. What do you mean? Oh, I've got to open my pop-up. Okay, let's just, let's just go through them. Show my word. Jellyfish. Baseball bat. Bioshock. Mate. Trumpet. School of Rock. Among Us. Chest. Mad Men. Britney Spears. Can Bottle, Elasti Girl, Duck, Kendrick Lamar, Makeup, Bruno Mars, Freaky Friday, Stool, Jurassic Park, Bob's Burgers. How many are there? Catfish, Frog, Drake, Woodpecker, Lie, Steel, Soldier, Atari, Super Meat Boy, Gas Mask, Fan, Half Life, Taste, Popcorn, The Martian, Superboy, Frozen 2, Dirty Dancing, Apologize, Shovel, Rocket, Wolf, Turtle, TNT, Fight Club, Manager, Landmine, Green Arrow, Tangled, Bounty, Chair, Donkey, The Notebook, Incredibles 2, NVIDIA. This is... Congratulations, VT Experiments. Who won by two points? 
Okay, there you go then. Welcome along, everybody. <clears throat> Thanks for coming to the stream. Uh, that was charades. We'll, uh, maybe we'll do some more of that another time. Who knows? Well done, VT. Where's VT? Uh, VT, are you already a VIP? Let's remember this day. VT didn't know that a VIP was up for grabs. But it fucking was. And people will ask, VT, how did you get an, a, a VIP and add to channel? And VT will just reply, Sharadis. It was Sharadis. Well done. Well done on the win. Just plip pipping Frolicles and Super D to the post. That was really awful, wasn't it? I don't even really like playing charades in real life. Like, if, if that gets suggested at a party, I'm like, but at least you get to take it in turns. And so, like, you watch five people do it and then you just get your go out of the way. Doing them back to back like that was horrendous. Hello, Cade. How are you doing? Uh, really hated it. And now I've got to sort my camera out. Getting zero feedback as well. Yeah. Just feeling like a twat. Well done. So you saw your camera out. Oh, God. Right. I wish Cutter had done that before me. And it's so quick. So quick. I nearly just closed down the whole of OBS. Jesus Christ. I don't know why I keep, I keep saying Jesus Christ at the moment. That's not, uh, that's not, I never say that. Just pop and say hello, love, love the hair. Hello, love. Hello, love the hair. Thank you. Oh, hi, Dad, Dad. Thank you, Kate. You are bye. the sun okay, that bathes me in radiant warmth, the wind that carries me on the wings of inspiration, and the fire that fuels my determination. Thank you, Booch. Saw it and decided not to do it. Cutter, do you know why? Because I, I searched browser games to play on stream and every single fucking one you've done. And it's amazing, transformative, and everybody loves it, including me. But every single one you've done. So then I was just like, literally, that's Shiraz is all I've got left. <laughs> Shiraz is all I've got left. I thought, it's Monday night. Let's do a bit of evening entertainment. Nope, wish I'd never done it. Stick to the crossword. Stick to the damn crossword. Stream race it. Yeah, but basically I wanted to find something new, Frolicles. Like, people have... Everything people have done. Everything people have done. Everything I found, somebody's already done. That's, that's what I'm trying to say to you. Uh, really hated that. But yeah, I'm seeing Pip tomorrow as well. I wouldn't be surprised if Pip just gives me a dead arm. Fuck. Deary me. Don't try and emulate the best streamers out there. That's the lesson learned today. Cutter knows how to do those kind of interactive games with chat. I should have gone for a piss halfway through. No, I got hot and sweaty. I got paranoid that I'm wearing probably my least well-fitting tracksuit bottoms. For this, I could have put on my newer tracksuit bottoms. Nobody could have made that good. I don't think that makes me feel better, Mary. Thank you, Mary. Okay. Uh, what should we do? How do we clean the palette? Cleanse the palette. Clean the palette! Fuck. Property guess or no? We're not doing crossword because it's a Monday and they're always shit on a Monday. Oh, dear. <laughs> do we just go straight into Minecraft? Nice and good palette. I don't know if I'll do Property Guesser today. Let's do a Property Guesser. Instant change of mind. Because I want to do something before I go. I need to calm down because I've been jumping around getting all hot and sweaty. Uh, okay, if you're new, Property Guesser. Guess the price of a recently sold home in a location across the UK. But it's not about that. It's all about having a nose around somebody's house. Probably saying something slightly inappropriate, but meaning well. And also guessing if there's going to be a cuck chair uh, and what kind of grass they'll have. St. Albans, says Frolly, straight in there with St. Albans. I don't know where St. Albans is. Where is that? Is that like down here? 
Where is St Albans? Frolly. Oh, there. Nice. Okay, we've never done here before. This, I mean, this is a whole area, section of the country that I've never been to. This is sort of just north of London. I've never had any reason to go anywhere. I've been to Watford. I think I played top golf in Watford once. That was a good time. Been to Wembley, obviously, but uh, yeah. St Albans it is. Will that still be quite expensive because it's on the commuter belt? <clears throat> St Albans Council mandates cut chairs. Oh, okay, that's going to be handy. All right, so we've got 12 pitches. We've got grass out the front. It's a three-bedroom terrace property. Which one is it? I mean, which one is it? If this is the picture, I'd be a bit annoyed. Which, which house is it? Tell me which house I'm actually looking at here. I reckon they're both three bed. Oh no, this has got an extra room on the side, this one. That's a bit confusing. Yeah, it must be the left. Okay, first of all, let's delve deep into what's happening with these mouldy rocks. Are they, are they, all, are they all mossy and mouldy and slippy? That's not a good look. Get rid of them immediately. Definitely need to get the pressure washer on that bit of uh, path. Lush grass, but I imagine most of that is clover. And moss, but it still looks very nice and green. Uh, we've got a little bit of water damage, a bit of like staining from the water over this bit, but at least you're getting protected. Um, however, when you're, when you're running in with your shopping in the rain and you're standing here getting your keys out, you're fucking, you're jealously glancing over to your neighbour where the whole family could stand and remain dry. Maybe that's why they're moving. Three beds. Let's have a bet. Sorry, I forgot. Let's have a bet. So the bet is going to be what lawn will they have in their back garden? Two minutes. Real, fake, no grass at all. Bet your pats. Sorry. Okay. Hello, Cobra Spy. Yep. Yeah. Is this for sale right now, by the way? Or how recently? Trying to think about recent trends in house prices. That is very uh, clever of you. Um, we, it's usually within the last few months. Are they glass bottom windows at the front? Yeah. Frosted, though. So you could be you could be trouserless, but all they'd see is just uh, a couple of blurry pins. Get your bets in. I'm just going to see what the info says to see if I can read this. If it says anything about the garden, does it say anything about the garden? No. Three bed lock up garage, open plan kitchen dining room, generously proportioned sitting room. Will be the judge. Generously proportioned. That sounds like something a creepy old uncle would say. Um, rear single story extension, first floor family bathroom with separate WC, freehold, council tax ban D, EPC TBA. EPC TBA, guys, okay? EPC TBA, TBC. Let's see where it is. London Colney, that's, ex that's where the Arsenal training ground is. Is this why you picked this, Frolly? Is this where a load of the Arsenal players live? London Colney is where the Arsenal training ground is. Now I know why Frolicals picked this. Shit. So a load of Arsenal players probably live around here, although they probably live... <gasps> wow. Arsenal Football Club training, next to Watford Football Club training. I knew they were close. I never knew they were right next to each other. This is exciting for me, guys. Um... Well, that's pretty cool. If you're into that kind of thing. Floor plan. In. Porch. Oh my God, that is generously proportioned. Dennis Burkham used to live in this very house. Watford bought Arsenal's old training ground. Look at these facts. Both of those completely true. I mean, if anything, you need to be knocking this through. Oh, that's a kitchen diner. You, I mean... 
This is oh massive. Oh my gilly goodness. Booch, how you doing? Thank you very much for the resub. Nine months you've been around, Booch. That is actually incredible. Um, thank you very much. And your breakfast this morning looked phenomenal, I thought. Really, really good. If you want to see what Booch had for breakfast today, uh, it's in Cudder's Discord, I believe. Is it? Was it in Pips? It's also in Booch Daddy's Discord. Go there first. Support support the creator. Um, we got the kitchen dining. They're saying it's open plan, I guess. Maybe this is like a, maybe there's a hatch or something here or a breakfast bar situation. Although you're not going to have a breakfast bar over the sink. And then you've got a separate study. Upstairs, bedroom, 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 separate toilet and bathroom. Okay, okay. Should we have a look inside? We're hoping for furniture and signs of life. And hopefully, maybe even signs of death. Yes, we have it. Look at the spongiest sofas of all time. I think Mr. Soft lives here. I think Trebor's very own Mr. Soft. They, somebody has definitely passed away. Oh, well, I don't want to, but I, I'm sorry, but somebody has. Some awful things have happened in this particular chair. The slippers are there. Oh, no. Why have they got sofas that match the wall, the colours of the wall like that and the carpet? They've got a lovely staged photo here. Lovely staged photo of the whole family, a little toddler standing, it looks like. It looks like maybe facing the wrong way. Um, is this generously proportioned now that you look at it? The wear on the carpet below that chair. That, you've got a blanket. Fucking chuck the blanket over the stained armchair. You've got to. And I would love to know what trinkets are on this, little, this old man's little side table, his own personal side table. It's definitely an old man, by the way. I'm sorry to, I know I should, should try avoid, to avoid gendering things where possible, but this is an old man's seat. It just has to be. Although I don't really know why I'm saying that. Maybe it doesn't have to be. Um, really dusty. What we've we got going on here, an old hi-fi. Awful flow. Photographer in the mirror. <gasps> I thought that was a statue. It's a silhouette of the, of the photographer wearing a long coat. I thought it was a statue. What is going on in the cup in this little cupboard? What what's this? I feel like this is like a face. I'm really sorry for the awful quality. I wish we could enhance. Should have bought a cover for the chair, you're right. Right. Um Lots of family photos. That's nice to see. Is this a 1030 print? Is that this blown up? I think they might have got one of the 1030 prints for, uh, for subscribing for three months. It definitely looks like it. Ah, hello, Wolves. How you doing? Hello, Brian. Hello, hello I'm Ad, Ad, Ad. I run the pod Bible. Is there oh an urn there? Oh, my gilly goodness. Oh, you think that might be an urn? Florence, how you doing? 16 months. Thank you very much for the sub. Hello, Capriso. Capriso, haven't you just gone live? Capriso, didn't you go live like five minutes ago? Are you just watching my stream on your stream? I just got an alert on my watch saying you've gone live. You're not live anymore. Sorry, Capriso. Sorry if that was just a test or something and I brought attention to it. Accidentally clicked the live button. Right, okay. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, I'd like to see what books they've got in there. I'd love to see the photos. We want to have a little delve around. But anyway, I mean, those sofas, for me, personally, an absolute nightmare on the lower back. Absolute nightmare. They're not off offering lumbar support at all. Sure, lying out on this, on this big one here, probably quite comfortable. Um, but there's no signs that anybody's done that. 
That looks relatively fresh compared to the marks we've got elsewhere. Anyway, we're in for a treat with the rest of the house. Or are we? So boring. Lime cordial. What have we got here? Okay, boom. Let's check everything out. Standard kitchen. They've got a home sweet home canvas. Do not react. Do not react to that. It's fine. Uh, good selection of utensils. <clears throat> Stained uh, wooden spoon. I'd suggest it's time to get rid of that particular wooden spoon there. Wooden spoons can actually harbour quite a lot of uh, dangerous bacteria and you should replace them fairly regularly. We don't. Um, in fact, my mum and dad, I think they've got a wooden spoon they've had for about 30 years. But you should probably get rid of them, especially if they get cracks in, like chopping boards. If you get a crack in a wooden chopping board, you need to get rid. Yes, Brian. We've got eggs. They've got two eggs left of half a dozen. Kettle. Orange squash, lime cordial, is it lime cordial or am I wrong? What's this just unlabeled clear liquid? And then a jug of unlabeled clear liquid. Hmm, more bacteria than spoon at this point. Not liking the unsymmetrical handles on that under sink cupboard. <gasps> oh, why did you point that out for me, Em? I can't believe this. Anyway, not much going on here. It's fine, isn't it? Functional, fine. You could upgrade it easily, but it's also fine. You could just paint the cupboards, get some new handles. I hate to think what it's like through here. Oh my gilly Beth, business. thank you very much for your sub. That's so kind. Second month, thank you very much. Thank you very much for your sub is something. That's a way, I don't think I phrased it that way before. Standard 2000s kitchen. Yeah, I was expecting it to be kind of worse. I thought, I thought we'd see some interesting, like hopefully some grubby stuff. But it looks like they keep it quite clean. So that's good. That's good. Here we go. Other angle. What have we got? Are these multi-packs of Kleenex? Extra large. What are they? What have they bought five of? <gasps> Or is it like apple pies? Does anyone recognize what these are? One, two, three, four, five of them. Five boxes of something. Mince pies. Morrison's apple pies. Mr. Kipling. Look at this. We're all thinking apple pies. Right, let's, let's, have a, let's do a bit of research. Mr. Kipling apple pies. Correct color. Oh, maybe it's the one with the multi, the different pies. This looks like it could be the Mr. Kipling logo. Morrison's and the Sainsbury's near there. Is there Frolly? Okay. We think Mr. Kipling, apple pies, Battenberg cake. We need a side view, hot apple pie boy. <laughs> um, I mean, there's quite a dark green though. Are these, these are Asda or Lidl. See what we're dealing with here. Look, oh, here we go. This is what we need. This is perfect. This is exactly what we need. Uh, right. Mm. 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 <laughs> oh. It's had another, like, moment of clarity of what the fuck am I doing. So sort of offer pack with the yellow bit on the packet. That's what I thought, yeah. It's like some multi-pack. It's like buy five. Or, get you know, buy three, get two free. What kind of deal do you get five? I don't think we're ever going to know what these are, sadly. Anyway, tissues on the microwave, ready to go for any spillages. Nice. Some uh, other bit of pastry here. Got a bit of kitchen roll. Big old tea towel on the fridge. That's a bit shit. Because either you're going to open the fridge and that's going to like flap over and get stuck in the fridge. Or it's already pinned inside the fridge, which is compromising the seal of the fridge. You can't comp compromise a fridge seal. You can't do that. 
So maybe it's strategically put there to cover up photos, Mary. Maybe Mr. Kipling lives here. I think Mr. Kipling is long dead. Sorry to break that to you, Les. Do they have a big fridge freeze and then a smaller fridge there too? Shit. What's this down here? We haven't even looked at this. Sorry, what is this thing? Is this not... Is this the boiler? Is this a giant boiler? It's not even the fridge. This is the fridge. Oh my god, Luna. Luna, one of those upper corner cupboard handles should be the opposite side. They're so cramped. Look at this awful situation. How often are you going to go to open that one and accidentally open that one? Or go to open that one and wrap your knuckles on that one? Horrid. Oh, Les, don't talk about caramel shortbread here, please. I fucking love them. What is this, please? Does anyone recognise this? Is this a massive giant boiler? It's very weird. What's this? You've got a vent here. Chica, how you doing? Nice to see you. Thanks for coming in to say hello. Chica, everybody. Somebody we met via Cudder. Cudder raided Chica the other week. Uh, or Chica raided Cudder? I can't remember. But an amazing... Um, Minecraft streamer, well worth a follow. Chica, we're just having a little look around um, houses. <laughs> we're playing property guesser, which means we have to guess the value of a house. This is a house just north of London. And we're trying to work out what this is. This is a fridge. Is it a big old freezer? Freezer like a chest freezer, but vertical, maybe. But what are these little details here? It's very old, isn't it? stream streamer knows right now caca socks hello this is a good an, an, uh, analogy sorry <clears throat> struggled with that and then focused on the word anal within it this is a good analogy for how cramped london is it is uh welcome um anyway the kitchen's kind of fine let's move on we want to see bedrooms what is this oh this is apparently the study and we've got another freezer in here or a fridge and a big yellow bucket. And some old papers. Little heater, little plug-in heater. Obviously, maybe damp is a problem in here. <clears throat> oh, shit. Grass. Yeah, that carpet. Look at this quaint little picture. What have we got here? We've got grass outside, by the way, so we're going to be paying out on the bet. Could you even see those books behind my face? Sorry, shit zooming, and then I zoom straight out. Boom. Colour London Street. Street Finder. All the classic stuff that a dad or a granddad would have. Um, it looks like that's definitely grass outside, but I'm not going to confirm or pay out the bet yet because it might not be. Lots of fridges, lots of different fridges. You could turn this into a decent office though, couldn't you? Nice and bright, lots of natural light. Strip it all out and start again. Next room, dining area, two pairs of Crocs. Actual Crocs or are they like, no, they're the shit like grandparent version of Crocs. <clears throat> look at the placemats let's put the placemats in front of each place setting it looks a bit weird why have you done this that's just because they always eat just the two of them every night it's always just the two of them and they sit here and they sit close to each other which is kind of sweet oh god Norman just glares out the window doesn't say a word for the whole meal imagining what it used to be like to frolic outside Imagine what it was like to be young. Janine just sits and stares at the home sweet home. Canvas. Repeating it again and again. Home sweet home. Home sweet home. Home sweet home. Toying with the last bit of gammon on her plate. 
wondering why she fucking bothered boiling it for six hours. Norman hasn't said a fucking word. As he cracks open another giant bottle of beer. Or another can. From his little stash that he has by his ankles at all time. No matter which room. We got a crutch. We've got. Is this a magic eye? <laughs> and what's this little spoon thing? Uh, I'm okay. <laughs> um, fake celery or look at these crocs ready to go. I love that. That's a bit like my back door, actually. And my Crocs are always ready to go at the back door. Always ready to go. Slip them right on. Come back in. Turn towards the door. Take them off so they're ready to go next time you, you come back to the door. Always thinking about future ad. <sighs> next. We've got a fucking cut chair. We could have done a bet because we saw grass. In fact, was there grass here? Was the grass... The grass is confirmed. We could have done a cut chair bet. I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's definitely grass, isn't it? It's definitely grass. Let's have another zoom in. There's nothing fake about that. I think we can pay out on grass, but I'm not going to yet, just in case. Anyway, here we go. There's a cut chair. Oh, good God. There's a cut chair and another pair of shoes under here. And these like floppy, floppy Uggs. We've got some floppy Uggs. This is the green theme. We see a lot of this with elderly people, don't we? The older generation like a themed room. Uh, this is like the avocado room. Very green, even the old painting here. Nice enough bed sheets. I like those bed sheets. It's just um, the, the lampshades and everything else. Classic old alarm clock. I've got the full length mirror. We've got the cut chair. Not much else going on, really. Spare room, depressing as fuck. I'm not sleeping in here. Get that teddy out immediately. I'm terrified. Get it out. Weird marks on the floor. Do they not have any radiators? Do they just have to have the plug-in ones? I don't know. That's interesting, isn't it? Have we seen any radiators? They don't have radiators. They've just got plug-in heaters everywhere. No central heating. That's interesting. Did it say that? That's a bit of a in the, like in this day and age. That is a that be a, that's a, that's a shame, isn't it? That's tough. That is tough to be in a situation with no central heating. Um. Anyway, let's not focus on that because that's sad. Um. Is this a nice bedside table or is it? Not. Also, is, is this a bed? Because it's absolutely fucking tiny. It's absolutely tiny. I'm trying to zoom in because I know my head's kind of in the way. Look how small this is. Little futon. Lots of natural light. I feel like we need to move on. Uh... Oh yes, here we fucking go. We got an office. We got a little another little cut chair, another heater. You've got the curtains all the way to one side. Fucking it's business time in here. Yeah, we don't need to follow the normal the normal rules and regulations regarding curtains. I'll put both of them to the right so I get maximum light. So I can come in here and read my old bills or whatever it is. Lovely desk setup, classic old calendar. Map of the local area. Oh, that kind of office chair. Not good, is it? Heaters everywhere because of the loving warmth of the house left years ago, Luna. <laughs> that is good. <sighs> oh, man. <clears throat> Remote control? What else can we spot? Paperweight, classic green glass with bubbles in it, paperweight, a little bit of filing over here. 
pinboard. It's fine, isn't it? That's the third bedroom. And here we go with the bathroom. Oh, let's pin up the sticky mat. Let's hang up the mat to dry. That is such a uh, grandparent thing to have is one of those. Obviously, for you know, it's for safety so they don't slip in the bath and stuff. But um, that reminds me of my grand's house so much. Oh, my God. Pinning it up's good, though. Most people don't tend to do that, do they? They just leave it and then it can go mouldy. They've pegged it up. And they've pegged up their little floof, poof. What are they called? They've pegged up their whatever that thing is. We've got birds on the shower co uh, curtain. That looks new. That's, that's good, at least. Uh, the bin bag's way too big for the bin, but I don't want to focus too much on that because that we all make that mistake fairly often, whatever kind of bin you get. Sometimes you get bin bags that are just too big. Uh, potential of floss. Loofer. Is that a loofer? An exfoliator. Toothbrushes over here rather than over here is an interesting vibe. Standard, it's also one of those. I've, we've got one of these in our bathroom. Uh, it's like the, the spring curtain rail that gets pulled down so easily. It's not like a permanent fixture. Deary me, and there's the garden, that's grass. Where's piss? Yes, we haven't seen the toilet. We haven't seen the toilet. How many pictures we've got? We've only got one picture left. Let's hope we get to see the toilet, hey? Uh, let's pay out anyway will there be grass will it be real will it be fake will there be no grass at all 92% of you said real grass you're getting paid good on you everybody else who went against that one day it will come one day it will come off <clears throat> quite fond of that curtain super D let's see this separate toilet come on come on is it going to be a carpeted toilet show us what? Why aren't they showing us? What secrets? Little bird bath. Kind of pathetic, but better than none. Is this a bird feeder in a bird bath? They've got birds on the curtain. They're into birds. It's a bird friendly place. There's no sign of a cat flap. The grass is the toilet. Could be. There we go. So, three bed, terraced property. Definitely in need of updating. Carpets, walls need painting. Um, you also might want to install central heating. There's no central heating in this house, which is the first for us, I think. But it's just north of London, so it's quite a desirable place, especially if you support Arsenal Football Club, because it's literally right near their training ground. And there might be people like that who would spend a lot of money. It's this house on the left. How much are we thinking? <clears throat> 310. One sec. Never been more grateful for your place, Chica. 420. Oi, oi, Blake Town. Knocked some off the lack of central eating. 355, 380, 440, 380, 372. Okay. Uh, I think we're going to go for Mary Biscuits is 355. Oh, Booch Daddy, three grand off. Precious Rogue Beth, you got it. Bang on, Beth, congratulations. Smashed it. And you were saying stuff earlier about thinking about property prices. Do you know your stuff, Beth? Do you work in this industry? Well done, nailed it. Right. It is now time to get into Minecraft. Always shot by the prices. It's a fun thing to do, isn't it? It's a real feel good game to play uh, live on Twitch. Make everyone feel good about themselves and their situation. We're going to play Minecraft, uh, but before that, I'm going to have a little break. I can feel my voice going, which is not a good sign, is it? You live in St. Albans and your job involves stuff to do with houses, so you have a bit of an advantage. Nice. Um, while this is loading up, I'm going to have a drink. Let's watch a bit of a BRB. BRB. Bro. I can't believe this, guys. 
Goodbye, Pat. I love you. I loved you. We all loved you, Pat. Sure, 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 sure. Boom. Shall I just make Cut of Paranoid? The holiday hall, it goes to do do Let's go. I don't know. I'm going to be on a delay as well, so. Apologies, I'm one. You're not even. I've already done one. You haven't turned it yet. Yes, where are you? Can you move slightly? Because I can't move behind the tree. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> I've got panic then. There. It's all right. I can, I I can look out. They've thrown a grenade. There's a grenade near my body. It may kill me. <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm long. Right, I think <laughs> they are as well. Yeah, they got the circle on their side as well. Thanks very much for your question. Walls, would you rather piss into a shoe or shit into a sandwich bag? Oh, wow. Piss into a shoe. Really easy. Shitting into a sandwich bag would be so hard. I, try, I put soup in a sandwich bag and I get it all down the side. Thanks for your question. Oh, my God. Oh, wow, wow. Very well for you. I've got guns now. Don't I? Have you still got eyes? Yes, my eyes are still very much in That'll do. I didn't actually go anywhere. I set up Minecraft though, and uh, had a drink. How can I do less talking? Somebody else want to do some talking instead? So. Oh, look at that framing. Look at that framing. I tried to do it in studio mode and I couldn't. Uh, there you go. So if you're here and you haven't been following all of the Minecraft, loads of stuff's been happening. We've got a realm cutter set it up um, and we've been having a lot of fun in it, mostly going on adventures, moving dogs, uh, getting to grips with the game again, basically. Some of us had hardly played it. Some of us hadn't played it for ages. Um, so we've been getting to grips with what we're doing. Anyway, the idea came up to do a four in the bed, which is a, a Channel 4 TV show where four B&B &B owners get to visit each other, stay a night, do an activity and uh, mark each other's B&Bs, um, give them scores and then at the end decide if they will pay full price or underpay or overpay for the uh, night that they had in the B&Bs. We've decided, this does look like Cutter's B&B, We've decided that we're going to do our own version, we being me and Kada and Llama and Funkle Albert. And so we've all been plugging away, um, mostly secretly. Kada and I have streamed it a bit. So like I, I know that Kada is doing his in uh, a cherry blossom biome. Uh, that's kind of all I know, really. Um, I've streamed mine a bit. People know a little bit about mine. Um, no idea what Llama's doing, no idea what Funkle's doing, but apparently Funkle has n nearly finished, apart from the activity. Um, we were chatting a bit in the Discord today, and by we, I mean me and Funkle, uh, Cutter and Llama just, just ignored it. Uh, <laughs> trying to work out when we're going to do the streams and stuff, because obviously we're going to need to do like four or five streams in a row. Uh, and we're very excited. Funkle is organised. So yeah, I've got a big to-do list. In fact, do I still have it open? Uh, Mr. Kipling. Here we go. Inspiration Cutter. Why? Because he watches four in a bed. My B&B. Three, three guest bedrooms. Yes. That's all sorted. Dining room, whatever, whatever, whatever. Stuff I needed to sort out. Glass. Sorted. Flowers, sorted, lighting, mm, kind of, furniture, kind of, lifts, we might be able to do lifts today. Exits, no, not sorted yet. Garden landscaping flowers, no, not sorted. Moving the entrance, probably going to do that today. Sort out lake bed. I've done that. I've sorted that out. A name and a sign for the B&B, haven't done. Decide on price, decide on menu. I've also written load of stuff on here whilst I was uh, working today of things that I realise I need to do. Uh, 
I think I want some sea lanterns, but we're going to see. But if I do, then I need to get Priz Marine to be able to make those. I need to make my toilet, which I've kind of started. I don't really mind, by the way, Taff Cudder. Um, Taff Cudder? I don't mind. Taff, I don't mind. Well, Taff, you do exactly whatever you want to do. Cudder, Llama and Funko, I don't mind if you watch. I, it, some stuff I'm going to keep secret and do off stream anyway. Um, but I'm not going to be like, stop listening. But I need to find some cats. I found some local cats. Um, but I need to collect them. I didn't have any fish on me. I need, also, I need to choose on an activity area. Activity area. And then I want to sort out my transport to it to it probably nice cutter are you going in are you playing minecraft right now probably going to um do a little rail to it might do that tonight i'm kind of in two minds how much to show you on stream because i think it's quite fun to like share the experience and let you lot see what's happening but then i think it will also be more impactful when we actually do the streams for some of it to be like for you to experience it fresh Especially if we're going to get you guys to market. But then also, who gives a fuck? Let's just, let's just do it. And if you see stuff, you see stuff. So let's get in. That's what's happening. I'm also not... Okay, I'm in my little hut. That's good. So this is my little build hut. To think I didn't build a little hut to have on my building site. And the first couple of nights, I was literally just had a chest and a, and a crafting table, thinking that I'd be able to fly through this. I've probably spent about 30 in-game days working on this. I believe it was Big Taffman who suggested a little hut. I think it was Heather, Biscuit Maker Heather, but I'll take your word for it, Big Taffman. Biscuit Maker Heather's not here to, to, claim, to claim it. I miss chat sometimes. Um, in other news, I built a little mine down here when I was trying to find some iron and some coal. Uh, so that goes all the way down there. And, and I was just trying to find some bits of bobs the other day. Um, I'll take your word for it. I've got a load of different dye. I've got one slime ball. I need... I need slime balls. If there's any Minecraft experts in the chat, what's the quickest way to find slime balls? Is it... I, I, I actually can't remember any of the options. I've only got one and I need about five. I've got a load of coloured... Um, swamps at night. Thank you. Have, I, have we found a swamp? Actually, should we just see who's in game? They're all in game! They're all in game! Yay! Uh, oh, here. Wasps and B. Dolan is also, are also on here. No swamps. <clears throat> um, no swamps, Funkle. But then, so no swamps near you. So maybe I could go hunting for a swamp. Got some rail. Thought the frog was swamp biome. I don't know. That was just exciting to see all of their names. It's nice to know that everybody's grafting. We've set a little bit of a deadline. We kind of want to get this done before Rust. Because wouldn't it be like we all want to be on that first wipe of Rust on Paige's server and it would be a bit rubbish if we haven't finished this? Because then it will be a bit like actually I don't want to play Rust, but I don't want to miss it. He started Minecraft again because of this stream. Woody. I think we're all influencers. You saw a frog. Right, maybe we'll go for a little adventure trying to find a... Uh... Those guys all went on an adventure last night. Um, Kada, Llama and Funkle. And they found Soul Sand. Oh, Soul Sand and Bone. And I have some of that now, thanks to them. So maybe I can go and find some a swamp. Hold on. 
My throat's quite sore, which isn't ideal. Uh... Do you think if I have a dark mint Kit Kat, that's going to help? Water, you know when water doesn't quite do the trick? Hello, Fluffernutter. I'm gonna have a dark mint Kit Kat. No. The community soul sand. <laughs> I might have to go and get a different drink that isn't water. Anyway, I did quite a lot of talking today. I had a few Zoom calls, so too much talking. Um, what else have I got? I've got loads of flowers. So, so uh, most of you have seen this anyway, the building. Cuddalama and Funkle, definitely don't look at the stream now then, maybe, if you want to avoid it. But this is how it's looking. This is how it's looking. So, there are little details in the bedrooms, uh, which I can sh uh, I'll show you some of it. Basically, if you also want to keep this as a complete surprise, then for the streams, then by all means look away. But I, I mean, I really care about spoilers and most people don't. Messing around with ideas for types of furniture, but I don't have the materials that I need, but this is going to be like a living room area. Uh, down here is going to be the bathroom. This is the kind of toilet that I've made, but it's giant. So I might just have a giant toilet. I want to put a bit of black carpet on there and I want to put like a switch on there, but it looks fucking massive. I haven't had enough uh, orange dye to finish off the glass for here. I'm, f I'm having to do a ladder. Uh, I'm going to make the bubble elevators here, maybe tonight. Uh, this... I hope they're definitely not listening or watching now. This is going to be Llama's room. Uh, this is going to be Cudder's room. Uh, there's more stuff to do. Uh, this is Funkle's room. Anyway, you get the idea. Oh, shit. I do have like a dining area plan, but I'm going to keep that. I'm going to keep that as a surprise for now. So one other thing, at the minute, the way that you'll get in, this isn't the door, this will all be glassed up and then you will get in through a tunnel and then a glass and then a bubble elevator. Here. But I wanna make <clears throat> Taff, you actually went back and checked the VOD. Uh, I don't want the entrance here. I think what I want to do, I was in two minds about this. Part of me was like, I might move the entrance, like have a tunnel underground and have the entrance like here or even like all the way back here. But then, and I get everybody to meet me like over here or something, and then we walk up to the entrance and go in. But then they're missing what it looks like. Hello, 4-7. They're not actually going to see what it looks like, so is that a bit pointless? But then they could always come out and see what it looks like later. Or we have a tunnel, but it's got a bit of glass in. Every so often it has a bit of glass in, and you get a little sneak peek. But really the joy is we'll be walking through the trees and then them seeing it, right? So maybe I'll leave the entrance here. I could still make it a little bit more fancy. I could even have like a... Better than this, obviously, but like a... I could make like a grass mound and actually have a door. But actually, maybe that looks a bit shit, I don't know. Um, my inventory situation is shit. I died a few times over the last few days. I need to make a spade. So I don't know. I think I might just leave the... Uh, 
leave that as the entrance. I don't know. I'll have a think about that. So, something else that Cudder did last night was um, change it so only 50% of us need to sleep now to get through the night. So hopefully one person will jump in. Oh, it's going on with my throat. Anyone getting in bed? I now feel like I want to go and see them. It's quite weird all four of us being in the game in separate places. Doesn't feel right. I th yeah, I think you need the high impact view of the place first. It's very pretty. Yes. So there's no particular reason why I've designed this like this, by the way. I just knew that I wanted to do something quite modern and I knew I wanted to have glass. Um, and I've literally just built as I've gone. Have you considered employing bee or wasps? Um, yes, big tough man. But now you've just given me another idea. Thank you. I was going to do green uh, for that, but I haven't been able to find the plant I need. Hello, B. No, you haven't. Big, big tap, man. Because I'd thought about, and now you've just given me another idea, so it's all good. Um, yeah, I can't find the plant that I need to make green dye, so I already had um, yellow and red dye, so I could make orange dye. Oh, my gilly goodness. Shunts, how you doing? I hope you're well, Shunts. I hope everything's going okay for you. Um, nice to see you. Thank you. Your typical Grand Designs fashion, there are big delays in getting the right glass. No, Cactus doesn't make green dye, I don't think, Josh. Although, now, now you've said it. Cutter asked me this earlier, and I was like, no, I don't think it does. But now you've said it. It does! Oh, no. Thank you, Llama. Cactus does. Okay, Cudder, you know earlier when I was like, no, it's not cactus, it's some other plant. It is cactus. Um, where'd you get cactus? Anyway, I don't need it. I don't need it. It does, but you need to cook it. Okay, Steph. Um, should we try these bubble elevators? I think that might be quite fun. I'm going to have to clear my throat every two minutes. Um, bubble elevators. Can anybody remember? Okay, so let's grab the soul sand. Let's just grab some soul sand. And then I need signs. I've got four signs there. Okay, so. I have made them before. I need a bucket of water, obviously. Hello, Sammy. How are you? Uh, let's get a couple of buckets of water. So. Bucket of water. And we'll get to. Let's. Oh, I need glass. I need to fill that with glass. Clear glass. Shall I make a quick spade? Quick spade. Uh, I want to keep all of these things. Let's uh, quit pickaxe for when that one breaks. Okay. First up, fill the hole. Actually, break the um, break this. Break this hole. Oh, there is no hole. Of course, there's no hole. I've been up there a number of times. Break this. Boom. Glass this up. Done. Right, so we're going up there. So first of all, in fact, let's get white concrete because I think I'm going to make it all white concrete down here eventually. So let's uh, white concrete, 
white concrete. <clears throat> Sorry about the throat clearing. It's not hurting too much now. It's just, it's just, uh, it's going to get like growly. Um, where's my, let's move my chicken. Oh no, of course that's going to happen. Have I got sand on me? Yes. Move one of those buckets. Okay. Uh, what was I doing again? Hello, everybody else who's just arrived. Who else? Willow. Hello, Willow. <coughs> Sorry. One sec. I feel like I just need to, like, scream. Right. Um, right. I am well, Shunts. Thank you very much for asking. I had COVID last week. I don't know if you're aware of that. Was it last week? Yeah. Kind of last week week before uh for five days it wasn't really bad or anything brain fog has been the worst symptom um but i'm still slightly tired and stuff from it I haven't fully got my energy back i've started exercising again but um I haven't really been able to bring my a game but apart from that i'm doing all right pretty busy uh with work work including minecraft Assume you know nothing from the past four weeks. Yeah, I really want to ask you all about your life and everything that's going on with you now. But obviously, most of it is very, very private family stuff. So uh, I could appreciate if you don't necessarily want to share on here. But I hope you and your uh, lovely new family are all well. And doing okay. Uh... That's right, isn't it? Okay, so, and what I'm gonna do is, cause I'm gonna have to do this eventually, let's make, fuck. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get watered. I know. Uh... Let's do this one. Let's get my sand in there. Let's, do this one. Get my sand in there. Okay, and now I can do that, 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 and that. And then I need to break this, get my soul sand in there. And then I put a sign on here and a sign on, oops, and a sign on here. And they stop the water coming out. And then I have to go up and pull the water down, right? Is that it? Or do I have to get kelp and do other stuff? I've just realized now I can't get back in. Well, I'm pleased to share that my son reached two milestones today. The first is that he left his incubator and now is in a hot car. Fucking yes. And the second is that he was allowed to wear clothes for the first time. Yes, chance. Love that. Left his little incubator. So, Shunt, I want to ask you all sorts of questions. He's fighting. He's getting there. He gained one pound from birth. From two pounds, eight ounces to three pounds, eight ounces. Fucking hell. It's so tiny. Amazing news. Thank you for sharing on my stream. I've got the little Shunt's exclusive. Honk, honk, honk. Shunt, that is so good. Bet you and your wife are incredibly uh, relieved. Yes. A hot cot sounds incredible. Um... So that means that you're like getting cuddles and stuff now, hopefully, and, and skin, skin on skin and all that good stuff. Well, amazing. Lovely to hear. And uh, yeah. Makes all of this Minecraft stuff feel quite futile. But um, tremendous news. Okay. Scaffolding. I'm going to have to break some of this glass uh, to, get, to get in here now, I've just realised. Uh, no, I can do scaffolding and get in the bit where it's open around here. Okay, so scaffolding. Get rid of the sand. Still in the hospital every day by his side. It's tough. He'll be there for three to four weeks, we suspect. 
Shunts, I'm with um, I'm with one of my colleagues. My ex colleagues has been in a similar situation. They had twins, um, uh, like a couple of actually, it was probably a couple of months ago now. But they were in a similar situation. They were born very early and uh, just very similar situation. Anyway, they're all home now. Everything's going beautifully well, and uh, I'm excited for you to get to that stage. Sounds like everything's going in the right direction. Just like my lift. Right, so I just do this here, right? And I can't see bubbles yet. Which means, do I have to put kelp in here? Did, did anybody tell me about that? Because usually that's working if you can see bubbles, right? No, I need source blocks. What does that mean, Josh? Sorry. I haven't done a bubble lift since 2020. Put the kelp in to create source blocks. Oh, you can't just do that, can you? You have to put a water block on the first one. And then you have to do like, if it's six blocks high, you have to do six lots of water. Is that right? So I've got, let's go and get. Okay, so how many do I need? Uh, uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's good. I think I've got 10 buckets. Add, just use kelp and one bucket of water. Put the kelp. What do I do with the kelp? Sorry. Put the kelp in to create source blocks. Right. So go back, put the water at the top again, like I just did, and then chuck kelp in as well. <laughs> Cutter's talking about bread. Pull water from the top of the lift and then plant kelp in the fake water. And it becomes real when you break the kelp. Uh, that doesn't make sense to me, Funkle Albert. Pour water in the top of the lift. Then plant kelp in the fake water. What fake water? What's fake water? The water below it. Do I have to go down? Just gibberish. <laughs> Oh. All water is fake. Don't believe their lies. Can't wait till Cutter complains about getting wet when he enters Ad's hotel. Shut up. I'm, I'm sorry, Taffman. I lashed out. That was unnecessary. I'd like to apologise directly to Big Taffman. Um, however, I'm thinking that a few people. We got a load of soul sand. These elevators are the best. Hopefully a few people will have these. I've just thought that people... If Cutter complains about getting wet... So I kelp here? And then break the kelp. Right. That worked a bit. It got me up a bit. It fired me up a bit. So do I just do more? Kelp all the way up first. But, what? Okay. Right, kelp makes the magic water. I've only got seven kelp. I've only got seven more kelp. But I'm going to, I can get my kelp back, can I? Yes! 16 kelp should get me through. I'm not going to do a lift bigger than 16. <laughs> Guys, I haven't done this for a long, 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 long time. I don't remember doing that with kelp, but I probably did. Probably did. So here's what's going to happen. Now we can imagine it. Hey, guys. Right. Come on. Hey, yeah, I know it looks absolutely incredible. And you're already giving me a 10 out of 10 in all categories. But let's just go down here and let's go in. I know it just looks like water. But check this out. Da -da -da. And you like one of those cool pop stars who comes out of the stage. Oh, that's fantastic. Thank you. How do we leave, by the way? Hmm. 
Yeah, you bring your luggage through the water. Fluffer not a, a... You bring your waterproof... We've all got waterproof luggage. Right. So, in theory, I want to build another one of these here. But actually, I think I want to build another one, like, here. Because we don't want to go... We don't want everybody going straight into Llama's room, do we? We don't want everyone going straight into Llama's room. I'm going to put different things on these. So don't worry about that. Um, so, where's the coolest place to come straight up? It's pr but then I've also got to think about where how that will look in the middle of the room. Probably going to be a situation where... That's the wall, isn't it? Maybe this. Maybe you come up right here. Because then we can build it. Mm. Actually, no. Sorry, you don't need to build anything up here, do you? So it's really a question of what I think looks good. Uh... Here? Okay, we're gonna go there. And do I have enough yellow glass? We're gonna make it out of yellow glass. Here we fucking go. Which means this bit needs to be more soul sand here. Is that a good position though? Is it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't overthink stuff, just do it. Oops. Doesn't matter. Don't need to spend ages on this. It's not important. I, I'm mentally prepared to come forth. I'm not. I'm just saying that so I can have a little clip of it when I come forth and I get really upset. I can actually say, well, actually, I was pretending. And here's a clip of me in the past saying that I'm prepared. <clears throat> I'm not getting choked up. I've got a bad throat. <clears> throat> uh, do I have any yellow glass? Fucking yes, I do. Do I have kelp? Do I have water? I need another bucket of water. No, I don't. I've got one there. We're all set. Do I have enough signs? Yes. Let's go. Could go up the lift. If you're aboard, I'd suggest Impulse SV Selectable Floor Bubble Vater. Mm. Somebody's played a lot of Minecraft, Josh. Have you, Josh, by the way? What's the tell us something cool that you've built in Minecraft? Everybody's so good. Uh that does sound pretty wild though. Here we go. Oh, it, it has to come out, doesn't it? I can't just do this, can I? It ha- it. In theory, I have to have that, don't I? Is that right? Actually, that might be okay, because then it can divide off the living room. I'm fine with this. We've got a little room divider, glass brick room divider, so so trendy and fashionable. Oh, and then... Okay, so now we get our signs here. One. Do we have to put three here? We do, don't we? Fuck, I haven't, I've only got two. Uh, I mean, they're very easy to make. I do need three though, don't I? Right. I think the landmines are my greatest achievement, though I'm not sure M though I'm sure M disagrees. Wow. I like when Ad makes fun of someone then immediately backs down. Big tough man, you have a very um astute way of picking out very sort of niche character traits that I'm very aware of in my personality. You've done that so many times. You I think you should be a uh Psychotherapist? I don't know. That I do fucking do that. Go in hard, immediately back down. Say something crazy and then go, oh no, no, not that I mean that. <laughs> no, it's a skill, Big Taff Man. You're obviously good at reading people. Uh, what was I doing? Need to make... Uh... Oh, do I not have enough wood? I've got wood out here. I need to make signs. What do I need to make a sign? I can't remember. One, two, three, six planks of the same wood. And I don't actually have that. 
Uh, okay, so in that case, let's get a new axe. Let's go and, go and chop down some wood. What just happened? I can't make an axe. I don't have enough sticks. Fucking Minecraft. This is Minecraft all over. Okay. Make me an axe. Thank you. Let's get some more wood. Quickly. Good, Taff. Thank you. Um... Mining to craft and craft into mine. Right, let's let's we'll knock out a tree that we're not fussed about. I need to eat. I'm moving too slow. What are Cutter and Funkel and Llama doing? I want to know what they're doing. I want to know what they're doing. One way to find out. I want to know specifically what they're working on. Even we don't need full details. Oh, uh, give me something. Mining. Okay, we know llamas in a mine. That's good. I needed that. I needed to know that. Never mind. What are you doing, baby? Fucking <laughs> god. Uh. Planks and sticks. Oh, it's because I haven't turned these into planks yet. Right, give me signs. Uh, give me... Which signs do I want? Oh, I want all the same signs. Those ones, yeah? Let's just get quite a few signs. 12 signs. Is that enough? That'll be enough for now. Here we fucking go. Dogs are probably overtaken wherever Cutter's building. I know Cutter's having problems with creepers. When I was on earlier this afternoon, Cutter went, fucking creepers, in the chat. And I think a creeper had uh, crept up on Cutter and blown up um, part of his building. Is it going to be a problem if I break this? No. I need that to be concrete too. This whole bar is just not big enough, is it? Let's face it. I'm going to make this whole corridor concrete. In we go. Oh, it's a bit tight there, isn't it? Should I move it along one? Yes, because also, look, I need to be able to get down there. Right. I don't have a silk touch to be able to break this glass. I can't move it along one unless I've got enough yellow dye. This is the fucking problem with Minecraft. This is why everything takes so much longer than you think it's going to take. Because you go back and forth and back and forth and back and forth and I don't have any yellow dye. Are there any yellow flowers? Mm. Let's find some yellow flowers. Here we go. New errand. Yellow flowers. Yellow dye. Yellow glass. It's all nice and easy. Yellow flower. Yellow flower. Yellow flower. That's probably enough already. It's too tight, Cutter. Uh, sorry, not Cutter. Frolicles. It's too tight. Too, t too tight. I need it. I need it less tight. Looser. Looser? You don't say that in a house. Oh, it's nice and loose. Nice and loose feeling in this house. Spacious. A good size. We want people being like, oh, it's a good size, isn't it? That's why I want those three to be saying secretly when they go to bed and they're speaking to ca the cameras. I wish we had absolute, I, I wish none of us had jobs and we all had hours and hours and hours and hours and we could actually make it and edit it and do voiceover so it was exactly like an episode of Four in the Bed. It would be so good. I am kind of hoping that we might edit it after into something. But to have like cutaways to where each of them are in the bedroom, like without me there, so I don't know what they're saying. Whereas in reality, when we do the stream, um, obviously I'm going to have to follow them around so that you guys can hear their reactions. Right, I didn't do very well then. You can have a third, pers a third party person to collect the scores. 
Um, we need to discuss that. I've, I'm hoping that on the final night of scoring, then yeah, we might have a um, a B Dolan or a Wasps or both there to host or help out. And get a replay mod to make editing and stuff easier. Can you? Cudder, we should get a replay mod. But the thing is, straight after this, we'll be going into Rust. And I lo I keep thinking about um, like edits I'd love to do. I really wanted to do like an edit down of the dog egg situation. We can only do data packs. Okay, cool. Um, but video editing takes a lot of time, right? I can't go to bed because there's baddies outside. Yellow dye. Uh, yellow glass, yellow concrete powder, yellow wool. Ah, have I not got enough glass to make a batch of yellow glass? I need to make glass. Let's use half the sand. I think I need to be able to put glass all the way around the side. I can hear Funkle saying privately to the camera, God, I've got my new clothes wet getting into the hotel. <laughs> It'd be great, wouldn't it, to do it properly like that? With all the, what the key, I can't remember what you press to bring up the different camera angles. Oops, not that. What key is it to to bring stuff to, oh, I don't know. <laughs> Your puppy grew into a gray doggo, F5. <coughs> oh my God. Yes. Oh, it's a bit tight in here for this. Uh, yeah, and this is how we'll get like the angles for the for the stuff at the start. Or oh, it'd be like this, won't it? Oh god, this is really hard to control. Be like this. Ad 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 is a single proprietor of the whatever the name of this B&B &B is in the whatever the name of this biome is uh, and I'll see if I can, can you cross your arms I don't know but we'll get we'll get some screenshots like this or each of us will have to stand outside their property and we'll have a little screenshot for the title sequence Funkle has made music Funkle has made music I was going to make lyrics and sing along, but I don't think there's time and we need to scale down this whole operation. But Funkle has made music, so we'll have to have a little title sequence. Um, maybe we can get some little cutaways of each house. Script needs some notes. I don't know what the B&B is called. I don't know where I am. Uh, anyway, just completely normally go back into the house. Glass. Make yellow glass? Surely I can make yellow glass now. Yes. Oh, right click. Yellow glass. Yellow glass. See, that wasn't so bad. We can now do what we've got to do up there, which is move the elevator. I've got to get used to going in this way now. Somewhere with a table you can all fight scores at the end. Yeah, well, B, I don't know if you're here. I know that you're you're a busy man who's planning all sorts of cool stuff because uh, of your new album and tours and stuff like that. And Wasps, I don't know if you're here, but maybe you'll watch the VOD. I think we've mentioned about maybe, like, it'd be amazing if one of you guys were up for it. You don't have to, but if you were up for building a room with a table where we can come and do the scoring, that would be amazing. If not, we can make a mud hut and just do it really easily and simply. But um, if you don't currently have any direction in the game and you fancy doing something, then there's an idea. Shall I go and get that soul sand? Nah. Right, look at this big old waste of glass. This is definitely right, isn't it? Yeah, because I'm breaking that one. I'm putting that there. Oh, we should use diamonds as our currency and say we could do that. 
but we'd need fuck loads of diamonds because it'd be nice to be able to do a big, it's not just like my, my, this room is four diamonds, this room is five diamonds. It'd kind of be nice to be like, well, maybe you could do that. We'll have a think about that. That's a good idea though, Josh, to use diamonds. The third room charges eight diamonds. Hello, moobs. Gold could be good. There's so much to think about. But we can put it all together pretty quick, I reckon. Okay, so fill that in. And don't fuck this up now. There's no, no fucking up. Boom, boom, boom. Merry Christmas. Emeralds could work. Right, and now that is a little bit, and now this makes this cosy as you come through here. We've got a cosy living area, but it also feels slightly uh, open plan. Signs. Get my signs on. Stop the water falling through. Go up and put the bucket down, and then kelp it all up. Water. Kelp. Delete kelp. See if it works. Oh, anyway, yes, thank you for a lovely evening. No, 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 you're absolutely fine. Um, uh, yes, if you'd need the lavatory, then the giant toilet is down there. Um, but uh, if you'd like to retire to your bedrooms, then it's just up this, up this yellow shaft. Oh, and uh, person C, I know who it is, but they might be listening. Uh, you need to go up the second elevator to your bedroom. You should be able to work out whose is whose. <laughs> right, we'll do another one there in a minute. Can I go back down this way? No, I don't know how I'm going to get up and down. I'm... I need to think about this. Okay. And maybe we'll have better signs than this, but uh, I, I will do this. Oops, in a better way at some point, maybe. Yeah, because that looks shit. Have you ever used that voice in real life social scenarios? Yes. Whenever we have people over, even if it's like my parents and they've been here hundreds of times. Yes, uh, Mama and Papa, if you were to just uh, follow those steps that are placed in a row, uh, the staircase, we call it, up, upwards, in an upwards direction. Yeah, the posh guest voice. Well, don't call my mum and dad Mama and Papa. Never have, never will. Mummy and Daddy, when I was a child, up until I was about 20. And then Mum and Dad, no, Mummy and Daddy until I was about... I don't know, when do you stop Mummy and Daddy? We're, I'm still Daddy. There has been talk of that, though. There's been talk about Alex has been like, when am I going to call you Dad? Because some of my friends call their Dad Dad. I'm like, oh, not yet. Maybe it's like 9, 10, you stop doing that. You call your Dad Poppington Bear. Oh, gosh. Les would be having a field day hearing you say mama and papa. Yes. Les is in the bath having a caramel shortcake though, so we're all safe. I'm not a fan of the signs. Um, Josh, it, you can use magma blocks to do the reverse of the bubble vator. Ooh. Is there anything else I can use instead of these signs that would look better? Mini moves is 10 and you can still get called daddy. Yes. Stop giving him help. Funkle, you could do a stream and get some get some help from Josh Won't Know. Stream after this, I'll raid into you. Anything that's an air block. So, like a hatch type thing. Yeah, okay. At some point, I just think that looks a bit shit. Somebody's going to complain about the sound of the bubbles as well, aren't they? 
Anyway. At the moment, this is how you're going to get up to, to this room. But in, do you think, do you think the lift actually needs to be here? I think it's fine that it goes straight into the room, right? Mm, but what if the guests want to come up and use this as like a terrace area? Which I was thinking of doing. But that would mean... Oh... That would mean having an, an elevator in here. So I reckon if people want to go upstairs, they have to go through Funkel's room. If that's Funkel's room. I just realised I haven't looked at OBS for ages. We're doing okay, we've got no drop frames. I'm on the right scene. Let's move that to the right place. Yeah, I, I need to think of better ways to get down. But I just, I didn't want to go and like break a lump, make a load of holes yet. In theory, you could get down here. I could have ladders. Anyway, let's work out where we're doing this third lift. Does it go straight into the bedroom? It would match the colour. I think it goes straight to the bedroom. Who gives a shit? Is everybody else is going to be perfect? Probably. Probably is. Also, it's really hard to get down. Right. And also, look, it's all set here. If I just do another row of purple here, it's all set. Armors is perfect, is it? Oh, okay. I need purple. I need some purple glass. Have I got enough? Yep. Put the yellow glass away. That's done. That's safe. Pip! <laughs> oh, you smack it. No, you, uh, mm, no, nothing happened there. Okay. But then I don't want a random pillar here. The right. Here's what's going to happen. This. It's going to go there. Yes. Oh, no. Red glass. Swimsuit and hard hat. No, you don't need a hard hat. Don't give them ideas of ways to mark me down. They're listening to this. They're making notes. Some of them are listening right now for sure. They're making notes. I can't go in there anymore. The habit. The habit. I'm so pleased I haven't moved the entrance all the way over there yet. Okay. So in theory... Boom, boom, boom. No, because I can't do that. And now I haven't got a fucking gun. Um, mm, I, I'm going to lose that glass. I'm going to have to smash it. Because I'd have to put a pillar here, wouldn't I? And that would cover up the room. But I could have the entrance to that room here instead. Yeah, could just have the entrance to that room here. No, because the front, that's the front of the house and I don't want a door there. I don't want a visible door there. My architecture is hard, man. I wanted to do architecture at college. I thought I wanted to be an architect. I'm so pleased I didn't go down that route. Mind you, I probably would have had some training. Probably would have been trained in how to architect correctly. Hmm. Fall in. Door in the roof of that room, just fall in. Just fall onto the bed. It's like a little fun activity. 
What time is it? 25 past 9. Okay, we're good. Time flies by in Minecraft. Did you study at college? Daylight, but then you would be restricted in your thinking this way anything goes. What? Oh. Oh, if I had learned how to be an architect. Okay. Could go straight up into the room, but Pip doesn't like that idea. But that's actually quite good because now I can rebuild that pillar, which was kind of annoying me that I'd had to remove that pillar anyway. So, oops. Bring back the proper pillar so that it's now nicely blocked off. Uh, that's all bedroom. It's the only place I can go up that doesn't go into that bedroom or start in that bedroom is here. So the only thing I can do is block off that door and then have the entrance here. But that means I have to do it off center because it's four blocks and I hate doing stuff off center. Although I have done that here and it looks absolutely fine and it doesn't matter. And I actually had to do it there as well. So actually let's not worry about it. Do I just do that then? I've got to do it, haven't I? Could have double doors. Am I actually gonna have doors? I've just realized I don't have doors. Am I going to lose points? Are they going to be saying there's no privacy? They're going to say that, aren't they? They're going to say that I don't have any privacy because it's glass. Fuck them. Not fuck them. Thank them, is what I just said then. Right, and then you do that, and then, uh, is this going to work? Can I do all of this? Does this just all look ugly? Also, what happens when I break this block? Can I put soul sand here? Am I going to have a chance to do it? Or is the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't do soul sand. I did... Fuck. And now I can't get up there. Okay, here we go, here we go, everything's fine. I need water, fill a bucket. Split a bucket, get a bucket, go down, get water. Go back up, I have to go through this way. Up, ugly signs. Up, end up going straight into here without meaning to. This is why I should do all of this off stream, because on the day, I'm going to present a brave face and be like, hello, welcome to my lovely B&B. &B. And all of the issues that have been have, had would be swept under the carpet. But by you watching me create it, you're seeing all the little problems, all the little uh, insecurities I have about this property. And ones that you're adding to my list of insecurities about problems with this property. But it doesn't fucking matter, and it's fun. Right. Right. Let's test. It's fine, right. So, okay, welcome everybody. Uh, here we go, we're just coming in here. Wow, this is really cool and unique. I love the way that you've done this. Thank you so much. And we're up here. Oh, wow, nice, I love this. Oh, wow, is this another way? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, sure. If you wanna go upstairs, that's where you go. Okay, cool, I'm gonna do that. Whoa. Mm, this is bad, isn't it? This is bad design, isn't it? I wish I had a silk touch. I wish I had a silk touch so I could break this glass and quickly rethink what I'm doing. ta -da. How'd you get down? You just jump all the way and you hurt yourself on there and then you get to jump down to there. Is it too late to start over? Oh. Two people are in bed. So there you go. Okay. Maybe 
the real solution is not to have the bubble elevators it's just to have the bubble ele elevator for the entrance and to have ladders because they take up a lot of space don't they this is cool this is cool and impactful this is a bit ugly and a bit much and you could just have a ladder can you make ladders different colors are there any other ways to go up and down and then you can come down the ladder i think I'm, my obsession with having bubble lifts isn't necessary can you can you um stain signs willow can you dye signs free code the dining room is is something is sorted i'm going to do that off stream um that is sort of sorted you like the bubble lifts um i still think i'm not going to do the bubble lifts the other ones I'm just thinking, like, this is quite an ugly thing. And then this situation isn't great. You could have a nice, simple ladder. Like here. Uh, the activity I'm going to have to do on stream. I need some slime for it. I don't know how I'm going to actually be able to finish this. I need some slime because I really need some, to make some sticky pistons for this thing that I want to do. But I might not get around to it. I think for ease of up and down from the rooms, lifts might need to be sacrificed. Trapdoors are a good substitute with the different designs. Uh, hold on, let me put this here. Look at the trapdoors. So, what, having, having them instead of the signs, you can dye the text or use different wood for colours. So bamboo is yellow, I think, and cherry is pink. Ah, uh, okay. Each wood type has a different design for a trapdoor. Do you, Josh, do you mean instead of the signs against the elevators? Do you mean for something else? Okay, yeah, that could look a lot better than the current signs do. Mind you, I am very tempted to get rid of these extra, these other elevators. And just have the one for the entrance. Or, or we do go the route where there's an elevator into each room. So it's literally, there's your room and you go into that elevator to get there. So there's, and it's not, because then we could have, we could have kept the one that came up into here. We could have the one that goes up there. And then we just have one over in this other corner to come up or into here. Hmm. I think it makes sense to just have the main entrance. Okay. Let's not overthink it. Let's make a decision. And the decision is to 100% get rid of all the bubble uh, just do I have to how do I get how do I actually get rid of this oh I'm stuck here now do I have to destroy the uh... just to drop a load of sand down good plan Okay. Why is this never ending? Doesn't matter. Uh, can I land on it? Nope, gonna die. Okay, right. Let's go down the other way. Okay, there you go. Uh, oh, good splashing noises.
All right. I th I've done all right at avoiding too much back and forth since playing this, as in like building something, breaking it, building it again, breaking it. I think we've learned some stuff here. I know there are a couple of votes to keep the elevators, but I think I might keep those two there for now for the divide. Don't want to go smashing glass that I can't get back willy-nilly. I quite like the idea of maybe dividing the room. Uh, but maybe I don't, actually. So, But let's leave that for now. No need to smash them just yet. Um, so if I was going to do ladders... Oh, I've left the crafting table up there, haven't I? Compared to the dog head, you've really exceeded expectation of the decision making on this. Thank you, Willow. So Willows are pretty... Uh, willows. Ladders are pretty easy to go down. Nearly a bit of a faux pas there. Um, let's make some ladders. Is there only one type of ladder? As in, can you get different coloured ladders depending on the wood? Yes. Oh, why can't it just be no? You're stuck to one decision. In fact, there's no decision. You want a ladder? Here's a ladder. What do I actually need? It's sticks. I don't have. Oh, I do have sticks. I've got. I've got sticks and seeds. I've got sticks and seeds. Some of that real sticky, icky, icky. Oh, I know that's no sticks, no seeds, isn't it? Um, right. Why can't I build a ladder yet? Because I haven't made the sticks. Fucking this game. Ooh wee. Um. No, the sticks are just the sticks. The sticks don't seem to be different colours. Sticks are just the sticks, guys. I needed to have made more. Why don't I ever have enough of what I want? <laughs> that sounds like me as a child on Christmas Day. Um... <sighs> have I seriously got to go and chop down more wood? Your turn. I like the idea of the trees having personalities, and as I walk past them with my axe, they're all quaking in their boots. So that's a bit of a weird thing to like the idea of, but. Not him! <laughs> I don't like that, Willow. I don't actually like that, and I know um, that you're a fan of trees, and I just, I know you're. I love trees too, okay? Uh, um, Funko, you have sand. We all, we've all got sand, mate. <laughs> what? Am I missing something here, Funko? Can anyone remember what I was doing? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Logs. Sticks. Stick, 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 sticks. Loads, fucking loads of sticks. You can never complain about the lack of sticks. Painting? Well, we'll have to see what the painting looks like. Um, ladders. 15 ladders. Is 15 enough? Should be, shouldn't it? I only need to go up two floors. What shall I get rid of here? 
eight dirt. Um, let's give it. Actually, I like having emergency dirt. Is there anyone else? I like having emergency dirt. Let's get rid of the gravel's useful because I can make um, my white concrete powder with that. So let's put that there. Oh no, we need iron. We always need iron. Uh, soul sand. Don't need that anymore. Let's put the wool in there. Let's put the glass back in the bottom. Come on, tidy as we go. Glass back in. That glass back in. Yellow dye into there. Oh. Emergency dirt. That'll do. Right, what are we doing? Ladders in the house. Let's go. Funkle's making an anvil. How are we going to go up? Where would I like the ladder? So you come in. Hello, welcome. Welcome along. Toilet's there. Yes, I know it looks a bit, it's a bit of a shit way to get there. I wish I'd designed it slightly better, but I'm not an architect. Um, it's, oh, I don't want, part of me doesn't make, maybe I do do a staircase. <laughs> oh no! There's too many ways to go up floors. Right, they do a shit in the giant toilet, which will look more like a toilet when I get round to doing all the other things on my list. Um, uh, glass stairs aren't possible, VT. I'd love that. Nice VIP badge as well. Look, at, there's quite a few VIPs chatting there. Um... You can make this kind of, these are prism, are these prismarine? I can't remember what, no, this is not prismarine. What's this, quartz? Quartz stairs. You can't make perfect white stairs, which is annoying. Um, or maybe you can, but it's too many layers of things I'd have to go through in order to get there. Lobby windows completely piss stained, they'll either love it or hate it. Yeah, I'm sure they're gonna say it's piss related to yellow. Um, I'll get marked down if there's no piss stuff. And I'll get marked down if there is piss stuff. stone cutter oh you think I can make stairs if I've got a stone cutter of the white concrete you think I can make white concrete stairs oh god how do you make a stone cutter oh god I thought I'd achieve so much more tonight let's actually just say what have I achieved one bubble lift hello KT is that all I've achieved? Oh no. That's bad, isn't it? Um, Made some ladders too. What about the old um, stone cutter? Do I have to go and find one of those? I think there's one at the village. There's a, there's a village not too far away. Because you can't craft those. Do I have to go and steal one? Imagine how much Llama, Funkle and Cudder are getting done now. Kyata. Yeah, I'm going to have to go and find one, aren't I? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's go here. Uh, let's go here to this old house. Let's um, stone cutter Minecraft just to double check it can do what we want it to do. Oh, look. Why didn't it give me that option even as a. So, stone cutter is just stone and iron. That's easy. Okay. So you can do cobblestone. Let's, let's find something that looks white. In fact, let's just search for the word concrete on this page. The, the, concrete is not on this page. So I can't cut my concrete. 
That kind of makes sense. Does it? Does that make sense? You wouldn't cut concrete, would you? You'd just mould it. In real life. If only I'd done the degree in architecture, I'd know. I mean, it looks like you can cut everything else, so maybe you can. The quartz is a slightly different colour, though. Quartz, there you go. I mean, I've already made stone. You don't need the stone cutter for that. I mean, I suppose if you've got lots of blocks of it. Hello, Carla. Shall I make the stone cutter anyway and see if I can do anything with my concrete, even though this wiki is directly telling me I can't? Do I make it? Yeah, because then we've achieved something else. Three stone, one iron. Three stone, one iron. Three stone and one iron. I'm not replacing all the concrete with quartz. Absolutely no way. <laughs> Even if it was in a month's time. Three stone, one iron. Boom. Boom. So I should be able to make one. Oh, it actually has to be stone rather than cobble. Okay, that's why. Okay, okay, okay. So how do I make stone again? You can fire it in here, right? And that will turn it back to stone from cobblestone. And how much do I need? Three. We'll wait. Little break. Hope everyone's doing well. Thank you for being here on this Monday night. Quarter to ten. I'm going to London tomorrow. I've got to get a train about quarter past nine. I'm meeting Pip and Stu. We're doing pod Bible stuff. We're big business boys. Pip's going to give me a dead arm as soon as I see him. I can't remember why, but I remember that was probably going to happen. Does the smooth quartz look any different? I don't know. Here we go. 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 Right. Hello, I'm Ad Ad Ad. That was a shock. I run the pod Bible. Stone cutter. Why the hell not? Where can the fuck can I put it? Out here. Doesn't need to be in sort indoors. Right, please. Concrete. Fuck. Look at all the fancy stuff you can do with stone. What are these lot saying? Bed? That's all right, Josh. That was it was worth investigating. And then I've got to get back from London in time to pick up Alex and take her to a gymnastics, which has changed from a Thursday to a Tuesday. Which I'm sure you're all delighted to know and find out and get the update. Um Fuck off. That's a spider, is it? Oh, that's a skelly spider nearby making noise what else have I got that I could cut in the stone cutter not much don't forget Tuesday bins yes shit you're right I need to do that tomorrow as well that's fine I've got alerts on my phone please obliterate the spider okay oh you didn't see me Unbelievable. Carla, don't look. We are very cool for knowing about Tuesday bins. I'm back. I'm, I'm purposefully backing towards my property funkle so you can't see it. Um, Enderman. I do quite like the idea of having some sort of spiral staircase. I don't have enough blocks of anything. Maybe then, we, instead of trying to get a, like a perfect white, we go for contrast. We go for contrast. And we go for like a, a dark step. A dark stair. I like a dark stair in a property. Do I? I don't fucking know. And when I say dark stair, I don't mean like creepily staring at the, the owner of the property. Um... I don't have any really cool stone though. I don't have any interesting stone to play with. 
nether brick. I didn't get any. That means going to the nether. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to bench this. We're going to put the um, how to get onto different floors at the back of our minds. And what we're going to do is go and find the area where I'm going to have the activity. I'm going to scout out a little area. I don't want it to be too far away, but I need it to be a relatively flat area. When we get there, maybe I'll tell you what it is. And I'll tell, um, even though I said I wouldn't do this, I'll tell Funkle, Llama, and Kada. I'll ask them to just mute the stream for a minute or so. So, um, let's do some admin ladders we haven't done anything with yet. Uh, let's put the coal in there. Anything we could be doing in here? Right. Let's put the kelp here. Uh, white dye. Spare blue bed. The bowls I don't need. You can't actually use bowls unless you put soup in it, I think. Like you can't put a bowl down on a table, I, I noticed. Uh, let's put the signs here. Keep the buckets on me in case I find anything interesting. The painting, didn't test the painting. Should we go and test what, in fact, let's just put it up here. <gasps> I mean, that's kind of nice. That could go in the, uh... that could go in the... Well, no, now I'm gonna start theming bedrooms, color theming bedrooms like I'm fucking an old person and property guesser. Super DC lady camping. Nice. And now I can't even get up to the roof. I have to exit through the fucking. And I've. Oh, all this just to put a picture in a bedroom. Be worth it though, right? Permanent bit of scaffolding is a good idea. Oh, fuck off. I can't remember how you do this. There you go. Get rid of that. I can't get up there. <laughs> and I've put the ladders in a box. And I've got no scaffolding. Right, emergency dirt. That's why we have the emergency dirt. Boom. Check this out. Why is it a different picture now? I mean, he would love that. Is it a different picture every time you put it down? I quite like that. I don't think I should remove that. <laughs> Scaffolding makes a lovely little side table. Ooh. I mean, that's quite a good picture though, isn't it? For the person who's gonna be in here, like the eight bits kind of design. Is this kara a karate, karate person and a policeman? Let's leave that, leave that there for now. Uh, and let's go location, go location scouting. Now the plan is probably to have a little railway going to where this location is. And I think I want to go that way. Maybe we have a little station here where they can get on and then you go through the mountain. I think that would be quite good. So let's just go and have a look over here. What's happened with this tree? Better sort that out. Please eat. 
<laughs> Good shout. Emergency dirt. Please eat emergency dirt. Ah, oh, love some chicken. I've gone back and forth to the main base a couple of times recently as well. And like Cardo was saying yesterday, when you have to keep going back and forth and you're sprinting the whole time, you go through so much food. I'd be eating about, uh, to go back to the base and come back, 30 chickens? It's, uh, it's pretty obscene. Right, I kind of feel, okay, actually no, maybe, we, maybe if there's water here, we could do it just on the coast. Might, may as well make the journey a good one. Oh, we could do it on a platform. Okay, right. Kada, Funkle, Llama, please mute the stream for a sec if you're listening. I will tell you in here when it is safe. Sage. Okay, they're muted. And if they want to listen, they can. Um, okay, so activity-wise, basically, if you haven't seen four in a bed, when people go and visit uh, B&Bs, they um, also get... Te oh, bad guy. They also get taken to do an activity. I've been trying to work out what to do, and I've had quite a few ambitious plans, and then I'm just like, I'm, I just genuinely... I'm not going to have time to do. I wanted to do the Spleef Arena, which is the cool Minecraft game that you can do where it's like snow and you have to dig out the snow from people's feet and they fall through it. It's really fun. But we'll do that another time. Um, anyway, I think I'm going to do like a... I was looking at different mini games in Minecraft on YouTube and I think I'm going to do like a parkour type thing. Like a parkour challenge is going to be the day. I was going to do the Spleef thing. And then I was going to do um, a frozen boat race track. But then I was going to have to make an ice factory. And I was just looking at all the stuff I was going to have to do. And so what could be quite easy is to do like a parkour thing where you have to jump from platform to platform. But the platforms are also on a piston. So the platforms, so it's like on a wall and the, and the platforms go in and out of the wall so you have to time your jump correctly it's like hardcore parkour and i could put lava underneath it but i don't really want people to die and then lose their stuff but then i could have a little box i probably will put lava underneath it just decided because i could have a little box for them to put their stuff in before they do it and they can have a bed anyway it's not necessarily specific to any of the people i haven't put loads of thought into it but i think it could be quite a fun thing to do and i think there'll be lots of laughs and we can have uh winners and losers and i just think it'll be a fun thing to yeah i think i think it'll be a fun thing to watch too so i'm thinking we get the train because that adds to the lava floor hardcore parkour that adds to the excitement uh you come out here oh imagine if we could do it at night time this is perfect i might knock down this tree and then maybe you walk out to the platform and we'll do it in the water, just like the main base is in the water. You walk out and I'm going to build it over here. But to start off with, I'm going to make the tunnel for the railway. And I might build the actual thing off stream. So again, that could be a nice surprise for you lot. Okay, so they're safe to come back. So it's just getting dark. Is this a good time for this? Probably not. Oh. Let's hope I don't come across any drops. Ah, my pick is gonna die. I've got another one. Hello everybody. Just just talking about my activity, you see. So that's why I didn't want you you guys listening. And obviously, we know how to build this from, uh, from previous experience. Is this going to come out on ground? I think ground level will be the same. Should be the same, right? I'm not going to come out like half a block lower than ground level on the other side. 
flood chat. Yeah, that's a good idea. Uh, but I'm going to write down that name. And also, don't flood chat before I've read Tav's message. Baby just woke up crying. I went to get him settled. I went to him, settled him, and came back down immediately crying again. Went up and went up, got him on the bed for a cuddle, and he said, "Watch dinosaur video on phone." And I said, "Look, we watch ad 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 or nothing." <laughs> Sorry, I, st I completely struggled to read that. Good. So is he watching ad 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 now to try and get to sleep? Um. Yeah. If you don't mind, chat. Can I ask you a favour? Could you possibly? write some stuff in chat so that the talk of the activity goes up chat just in case i know we're probably fine but just use some favorite emotes or something yeah sing us something soothing along to this music there's a guy i didn't know him well I met him in a vegan place. He was from America. He said words like swell. He had a beard on the lower half of his face. He was B. Dolan. Can people sleep? No. Thank you for moving it off the chat. When are we doing Phasmophobia? I don't know. I th I, I, maybe we will do that. I think we've got quite a lot going on. That was the interlude. Also, you say swell so much. <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard you say swell. Wizia, how you doing? How was your stream tonight, Weezy? I saw that you were streaming. Are you full on into Zomboid? What are these people saying? Cutter's parrot was killed. <gasps> Armas lost two birds as well. Just building a little tunnel. Different game, Void Crew. What is that? That sounds cool. More spontaneous. Yeah, if we ever get nice Minecraft music and I feel like I can just... Uh... I'm now worried about where we're going to come out here, by the way. I suppose it was quite a lot further than this. Um, we'll have some more interludes. This is a good sign. Here we go. Here we fucking go. We're going to pop out. Oh, no. Well, it's not... Actually, that's kind of fine. That's kind of good, actually, because it's kind of... It's a bit hidden. So when you first arrive... And you see all this, you're not going to see the little train station, so you won't know about that little surprise. Although, literally, they're probably now listening to the stream. But don't worry, there's going to be a little place where you have to get on some rail. Um, so, if I remember rightly, you can have a block, and then you can have a button on it, and then... You have your rail. Can't really remember it. Uh, yes, they will say yes, Carla. Add, who are you most worried about doing ta tactical voting? Cudder. There's, there's no way Funkle's going to do tactical voting. I don't think Funkle's got that side of him in him, which is a compliment. Like, he's... Fudder? Fudder? Funkle is just a, a lovely person. Would never do anything tactically. Um, Llama possibly might do some tactical voting. I don't think so either. I think Llama will vote 
uh, will score each one on its merits. Cudder has watched, what do you reckon? A hundred episodes? I actually don't know because I'm uh, usually in bed. Cudder knows everything about this show. Cudder knows how to win. It's Cudder. Do you think Lama will vote for the humour? I guess I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I actually, in fact, maybe at some point I should be. Maybe I should be thinking about the individuals that are coming to stay, and then make plans. But they don't do that in Four on a Bed. They don't know who's coming to stay. They just make the best bed and bed bed and breakfast they can. If it was just called Bed and Bed, that would be terrible. They come down in the morning and then get and then get ushered through to another bedroom, and the door just shut behind behind them. And they're expected to have another solid eight hours sleep. Rail. Uh, I need to make those torches, don't I? The fancy red torches. Oh my god, that only made nine. Card is leaving. Bye. I might. I'm gonna. Have to I'll probably go about half ten actually. Um, fudder, fudder, fudder! Can't you see? Sometimes your world just hypnotizes me. Very nice. You got work and luck. All right, Mary. Thank you for hanging out. Oh, I see. Cudder's left. I know you like Cudder, Mary. I know you're a big fan of Cudder. Always there early in the chat, and you think Cudder's a fantastic streamer. But Cudder, just because Cudder's left Minecraft. Uh, sorry. Enjoy your work. Enjoy your work, Mary. I hope you goes well. Bed and bed fast, the second bed's quicker. Have you considered a tactical vote ad? You can avoid this question if easier. I haven't thought about voting at all. I'm literally, you hadn't even known, yeah, it's just cut and said bye and left the game. And then and then immediately, Mary, you just went, right, I need to work and look. Um, you're too focused, right, okay, sure, 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 sure. Uh, okay, see you later, daylight fire. What was I gonna say? I haven't thought about that at all. I haven't watched enough of the show. I've got to think. I think I'm literally just going to go on the experience that I get. The beautiful thing is I don't know anything about anybody's except for where Cudders is. Cudders is going to be a beautiful setting. Um, I think Funkle's got the advantage of time. I know Funkle does other stuff, but Funkle is also in a situation where he can put quite a lot of time into it. And Llama is... A kind of an unknown quantity because I haven't seen much of what Llama's built apart from the barn and that is looking really nice the barn for the animal I noticed some extra details have been added to that all right see you later everybody everybody's heading off now Cudders stop playing um I think I think I think they're all going to be good I don't think it's going to be a situation where one of them shit I think they're all going to be good. I think, in fact, I think if if anything, I think mine might be the worst. Uh, so, I'm not going to be a shit and be like, I am going to pay one emerald for everybody. I'm gonna, I'm gonna vote fairly. That's what I'm gonna do, and it may come back to bite me. But in the long run, the viewers will remember. It's not like four in a bed where the series ends and that's them gone and you never hear from them ever again. We have to continue streaming after this. We have to try and remain friends. Hmm. We'll see how it goes though. It would be I don't at the moment we don't know who's gonna be first. That's obviously gonna you know. Something will happen on that first night. And it might completely change the course of everything. We were thinking maybe Cudder goes first. I was thinking this. And not everybody else has had a chance to reply or think about it properly yet. Maybe Cudder goes first. But then with another way that we were looking at planning it, Cudder could be last. And I think in the history of Four in the Bed, Four in a Bed, um, quite often the team who goes first wins, right? Because P 
people are all being nice and you don't get any of that tit for tat stuff okay so how do you do this mm. is it like this And then what happens if I delete that? Yes. And then I can have a block here with a button on it. And I can have, uh, do I have a chest? I don't have a chest. A chest with a minecart in it. Do you plan on adjusting yours based on previous nights? Mm, I hadn't, but if... Oh shit, hold on. I've got to go and deal with, deal with something quickly. I need to go and get a spider. And I'm going to deal with this because Hannah is a huge not fan of spiders. That is uh, the technical name for it. Um, hopefully I won't be too long. What should we look out on YouTube? I, can't, I don't want to play my BRB video. Meanwhile, Hannah's just freaking out inside of a spider. Do you want to watch the interview with Blinkway 2 about coming back? No. Nope. Do you want to watch a load of uh, slates? I'm just going to stick on this iron farmhouse. No, because this will be absolutely incredible. Fuck it. I'll leave it. Let's cut in a bit. Watch somebody building. I'll be back in just a sec. You can't see it anyway. Uh, I'll be back in a sec. The spider had gone. I went up and had a look for it and it's gone. Don't know where it is, so Hannah's slightly on edge. Look at this, look at this good building. But look, creative mode makes everything a lot easier, right? Look at the little details. That's fine, I've gone for something modern. Oh, Carla, I don't know. That does sound good. There's so much we could do. But yeah, Cutter was like, I've got so much I want to do. 
I mean, to be honest with you... Shit, I just stayed out. Look at this. I could have just died and lost everything. I like the way my house... I really like the way my house looks from lots of... Sorry, lots of different angles. Also, what is this music? Is that in the game? Yeah, it is. That is nice. Heather, how are you? Um, I hope you're doing okay. I've seen you've been, uh, had a bit of a, t a tough time the last few days. Um, yeah, what we could do is be like, actually, let's put this on hold. Let's do it in a month. Let's spend ages. But nah, it's better just to get these, this stuff done right. I don't want to be in a situation like the snooker tournament. But we've kind of given ourselves a little deadline and we said, let's try and get it done within two weeks. And if we can, let's do it before rust. Because um, then it gives us all a bit of a target. Oh, let's go to bed. Not in ICU, but still hospital. Well, I'm really happy to hear you're out of ICU, but I bet you're keen to get home. In bed. Anybody else? Anybody else up for bed? Just need two of us. Check out B00100. He does a lot of cool furniture, modern builds. This is the thing as well, Josh. It's just such a um, rabbit hole looking on YouTube. Because then I'm like, oh shit, I really like that toilet, which did actually happen to me. And then it's like, yeah, but in order to get that toilet, you need to make this particular block. And then you need to get that block, then you need to get this block. And you can only get that in the nether. And you can only get that if you're wearing this. And you need this tool with this enchantment. And it's like, oh. If we do this again next year, if we do other challenges in Minecraft, then we'll all get better. Um, but I think hopefully there'll be a little bit of a rushed shabby chic rough around the edges side to this I think we all need to take some shortcuts basically season 2 not in this it depends depends what the viewing figures are like Josh the commissioners it'll be up to the, the commissioners will be looking at the viewing figures if people watch also we need to do some promo of it we need to uh, I want to make some graphics and nail down all the stream days obviously we'll work around when llama is um up for being able to stream but hopefully we'll be able to do four nights in a row whoever finishes last shouldn't be allowed in the next tournament it said be all wasps in yeah i'm up for that and flesh flesh fresh blood you know other people who might want to do it we can do some other challenges and then the realm, you know, people will stumble upon this building in years to come and just go, oh yeah, do you remember that first four in a bed? Look at this shit house compared to what we're doing now. Right, let's do the rail. I'd like to finish the rail and then I'm going to log off. Because I do still feel a bit rough and run down from COVID, I'll be honest. In my throat. Don't want to stay up too late. Um, I'll do all the pa- Oh... Okay, we'll worry about that another time. We'll do all the powered stuff in a bit. Have I got enough? I don't. How much more do I need? Did I take it all out of the box then? <clears throat> Did I leave some of it there? Oops. I took it all. Shit. How do you make rail again? It's just wood and iron, is it? Sticks and iron. Easy. Although I now have one iron left and we're all saying how we don't have much iron. Okay. 
Still have my start house and nether app server fun to see progress. Yes, that's why I always like keeping um, like your night one mud hut. I mean, our night one base on this turned into our current base that we've got now, like our home communal base. But yeah, it's really fun seeing the progress. Just, I mean, I've only ever been on one server before this, but um, it's fun to get reminded of all the hours that you spent. Okay, I need iron. I need iron to make enough rail. This game. So, I mean, I could just do some mining at some point. But I think it might be, I might be better off leaving this. I'm going to stream again on Wednesday. I mean, London tomorrow. I've got a fair bit I need to do on the magazine. But I might do that all day Thursday. I need to do some other Pod Bible stuff. But yeah, I think I'll do Wednesday afternoon and then we'll see whether or not I can do another one on Friday or not. Um, yeah, and so the plan will be that you come out here, get off, the, get off your cart, and then there'll be like a little walkway through and then there'll be a platform out here which will be 15 by 6, something like that. Um, and this is where the activity will happen and it's a nice setting and if it gets dark we'll see the moon the sunrise or the moon that's east sun rises in the east isn't it um we'll see something happen we'll see the moon come up but there's just yet more unfinished jobs Jobs, 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 like the stream title suggests. I think we'll call it now. There we are. And look, does the door into that bedroom matter that it's like that? It doesn't, does it? It really doesn't. Don't say it does, please. Even for a joke. <laughs> I think we're good. I've got to think of furniture. There's actually quite a lot to do, so that's why it's important to just rush stuff and get it done, I think. <laughs> right. Thank you. Right. I am logging off. Still lots to do. Hope you guys have made good progress. Bye. Now wait, wait until they reply because otherwise Cutter gets upset. Hopefully I'll get a reply. They're probably listening to this. Oh yeah, we've got a chow. We've got a chow from Llama. Let's eat, let's eat before I leave. No, don't try and hit the bed with the chicken. Cutter's gone. I thought I might get a goodbye from uh, Funkle, sorry. Fuck it. Right, I mean, what did we actually achieve? When I, when I wrote on my piece of paper earlier, I wrote extend entrance, elevators, furniture, toilet, cats, frames, and rail to activity. I didn't think I'd do all of those things tonight. Don't get me wrong, I wasn't that ambitious. I thought I'd do two or three of them. I did half the rail, one elevator. Appalling, absolutely appalling progress, really, in the grand scheme of things. But all those journeys that I made, everything I did then had to be done. Lessons learned. Showed us your progress. You didn't have a mental breakdown. Learned about bubble baiters made a rail. Yes. Um, made some decisions. Had some ideas. Thank you so much for, especially, yeah, people like um, Josh, John, Heather, Willow, all the people who know a lot 
um, there are more of you who know a lot for the little tips and the guidance and the ideas. Um, Taff. Um, thank you, Heather. So yeah, I'll be back. And the funny thing is, to, last night I thought I might do my first ever stream schedule. I'm going to make a graphic. I'm going to post it in the Discord, post it on Blue Sky or something. My first ever stream schedule. I'm going to let people, when I'm going to be on and what I'm going to be playing. And I put Minecraft and then I put Snooker for Wednesday. No, immediately would have been wrong. Definitely got to do Minecraft on Wednesday because otherwise I'm uh, not going to get all this stuff done. Uh, so it's probably for the best I didn't do a schedule. Uh, there's loads of people streaming. Right. Should we go and see Seb? Do you remember the other day when I was talking about um, when Seb came into the stream and I was talking about how like talented and wonderful Seb is and that even though we've seen a lot of Seb in Sunday Night Shite Fights as, a, as one half of Endgame, the tag team, uh, Seb is a really great singer-songwriter. He's got a really amazing voice. I first discovered Seb in the Party Back at Ours or Party Back at Yours thing that Gusbo and Cade put, to, put together. Um, wasps! Wasps! Um, let me just double check what Seb's up to. Oh, I think Seb's celebrating three years on um, on Twitch as well. Yes. And the the guitar is out. Right, we're going to raid Seb. Come and be lovely. Chill out with some music. You could even watch another stream whilst you have this on in the background if you really wanted to. Um... My raid thing is so broken. It's showing loads of other streamers that aren't streaming now. There's Seb. Obviously, if it's in the middle of a performance, if she's if uh, they're singing like immediately, then uh, we might have to wait um, for for a little hello once that's over. But yeah, should be good. Stick around. Thank you very much, everybody. It's been a lot of fun. I'm going to go and find that runaway spider uh, and get some rest before my dead arm from Pip in the morning. See you later is what I'm saying.